the last digit of your birth year is zero then this is the message for you guys latest news from the universe or maybe you have chosen using the image then this is the message okay so let's uh, get into it um yeah i'm hearing a uh, freedom for you guys in some situation that you were a little bit stuck you're free from that situation that is one thing i'm getting here and because in your uh, you know in your picture you can see the birds they are flying high right and i'm getting that uh, energy you're you're freeing yourself from something um that was putting you in your cage i'm getting the scenario of a bird in a cage and the bird is finally unlocked and now the bird has like just gone and not turning back on that thing again just free from it not going back to that place again yeah so some sort of freedom here uh, so let's see oh you know one thing i felt like uh, very strongly is uh, uh, maybe for some of you uh, you were learning something and it was really tough for you guys um, or maybe the the person you were learning this thing with was really tough on you you felt really irritated sometimes when this person was teaching you maybe they uh, maybe they were very rude or they they were not matching your vibe here uh, yeah that's an example like a teacher who is very strict and you're not learning that much but you have signed up for it so you have to continue it uh, like that's the case it was and you were feeling uh, caged i'm getting this example of a driving a driving course maybe you wanted to learn driving and you were stuck with a driver that is rude that is angry but you know that you had to get your driving license so you just kept with it um and you went with it it was stressful you were feeling like in a cage but you tried hard and now you will, you have gotten the driving license so you don't have to get go back there uh yeah you don't have to look at that situation that's the energy i'm getting here so something you know that's just an example so something that has been heavy a situation maybe this is a company of a person that was irritating you and you were not liking it but you had to do it it can be like a group project that you were forced to work with someone but that's ending now you are not going to look back you're free from it okay so that's it that is one of the latest news for you guys uh, group number 0 let's see <clears throat> what else is the latest news for you guys from universe Ah uh, wow, you have been strong, and oh my God, look again the hippo. Maybe you have been seeing a lot of hippo patterns as well. Uh, again, hippos are very strong. I, whenever I see this charm, it's like uh, you giving your best, even though things were really hard for you guys. It was yeah. Again, it really this this is what I was talking about, isn't it? Uh, this charm is like telling me that yes, that's the thing. You were very uh, you know you wanted it, so you. you you went with it you were so strong you, it was very really stressful but you know that you want this thing you want to learn this thing even though te the teacher is rude i want this thing for myself like again if it's like the driving driving teacher right who who teaches you driving might be rude they might not be someone who you can who you can you know share your fears like please uh, slow down sometimes you know we can say things to people but maybe this is not the person and you had to be very strong right you and you did it you did it and you you're getting that thing that you wanted so you signed up for this thing you got you're getting it now you don't have to look back uh, and i feel like that's what the message is so if you if it's about a driving license test yes you're going to pass that you're going to get that now you don't have to look back you don't have to stress if it's just a course the examinations are done now you don't have to go back to that teacher it can be anything <laughs> yeah depends but it's like truly it's, it took a toll on you but you didn't give up wow beautiful you didn't let your fear uh, make you cute or something like that you stayed true and you're winning you're getting it okay so let's see what is the latest news for group number 0 from universe latest news wow money 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 oh sudden wealth hmm so again this can be making some sort of money as well maybe you might have felt like uh, this is the only um, you know amount i make right and you might have felt caged like maybe you wanted financial freedom it was not happening but now you are getting it you're learning something you're investing in the right places and i see that there is money coming okay so let's see more uh, maybe you are lucky you are you uh, you always um 
uh, like number seven or maybe it's with the something seven Libra energy is also coming here with the seventh house uh, <clears throat> oh that's a lot of cards so let's see what else here um, so money is also coming that's great uh, so yes your hard work is paying off whatever it is so again this is something oh so, so a completion of something a completion uh, again this can be an examination that was so so hard no matter how hard you tried you wrote you were not able to get the results that you wanted um, maybe this is an um, maybe this is an exam that you want for your job if you pass this examination your job will give you more money more uh, yeah your salary will grow right if this you pass this examination but look again you were in a cage trying so hard but you were never passing that examination but you didn't give up like the hippopotamus you were strong you kept moving forward and now you're passing that examination so there is an increase in your uh, money situation um, because uh, you have passed this examination that means your uh, your company or maybe if you're a teacher your uh, you know your uh, the college you work in or the school you work in they have to raise your uh, income so that can be the sudden wealth here uh, so yeah so let's see wow self-expression here like the because you're becoming a magnet to money here guys so <clears throat> so really for this group I feel like and this is an end of an uh, phase of your life where you had to struggle with money now you're now you don't have to uh, struggle with money you're over it now you have learned so much now maybe for some of you uh, you have been in this uh, uh, era of your life where you were not spending that much because you know that you had to do certain investment for your future and now you're getting into this next era of your life where you don't have to work that hard because money will flow because now you're in that energy you know many times our mindset is very important as I mentioned I always mention our mindset regarding money is so important if we have a pro 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 poverty mindset we are not going to be prosperous right we need to have that prosperous mindset in order to get that prosperity so before maybe you your mindset that was not that good right you had that black mindset but you worked on it you worked really really hard with it and now the way you think is prosperous and that's why this peacock is coming self-expression the way you talk about money is is, is prosper in a, is in a prosperous way the way you think about money is in a very 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 positive way right and i see that the latest news for you guys is there is money definitely coming money is not going to be a problem for you guys as i mentioned a cycle is ended for you guys here something that has been tough for you guys right uh it's over now it's you don't have to look back because that thing is going to be so easy for you guys as i mentioned a person who has been learning driving and he has been struggling and he made it now we got the driving license now he don't have to look back now he has his own car he's driving he's free He's expressing himself. He doesn't have to be with someone in fear. No, no, no. He's doing what's best for him. Like that with money as well. Now he can like have that extra money to buy the things that he likes or she likes. So they can express themselves in the way that they love. Maybe before they were not able to afford certain things. So they felt like they're not able to express. Certain people express themselves through their styles, isn't it? Maybe... Uh, maybe now you have enough money so now you're spending and you are finding your style so you're expressing it uh, and I really feel like you're becoming a magnet to money you're not chasing money anymore group number zero you're actually attracting money you're like the peacock you're attracting wealth you're going to be living a luxurious life as you move forward because of the dedication you have given money will not be an issue for you guys that was your falseness before it's not going this is about yeah money money <laughs> yeah again with the peacock as well <clears throat> peacock attracts and they are magnet uh, the peacock shows their gifts they trust themselves they're so proud of themselves yeah they show their talents and they get to because they're beautiful right <laughs> again that's the energy i'm getting here you are expressing yourself in a way that looks uh, rich and as you look rich as you feel rich you're getting that money right yeah so let's see what is the latest news for you guys numbers i never expected this reading to be about money though 
interesting so yeah for you it's money money coming your way yeah wow you will have the things for uh, for you know you will have the money to do the things that gives you a lot of pleasure that's what it is maybe going on vacations you will have enough money to go to vacations because your your vibration has been high you're not in that low vibe you're you're in this prosperity mindset you have already shifted group number 0 i feel like that so this was like again the steps you know you were taking the steps you were doing the work you were changing your thoughts you were uh, you know the money the relationship that you had with money was little bit toxic but you let it go now it's very very green kind green flag relationship <laughs> i mean it's not at all toxic it's like a prosperous kind of relationship you have with your money your money relationship with your money is so green flag that's what i feel like <laughs> the way you think about money is beautiful the way you feel about money the way way about you see yourself is that's what is important right and that's what is changing the things for you guys here so i see that wherever you're going to stay you're going to stay in a uh, stay in a place where you will have everything that you need all the resources will be there more than enough will be there for you guys here that's what the message is you don't have to worry even if you're changing jobs maybe for some of you changing jobs um uh, maybe you want to do something uh, that um, <clears throat> that makes you uh, feel like you're expressing yourself maybe you were a, you were trapped in a job that was not giving that now you're going to do something that makes you feel good and by and and even if you're changing jobs even if you're quitting your job and doing something entirely different money is going to flow yeah money is going to flow don't worry money will be flowing to you guys <laughs> yeah that's that's beautiful okay so let's see what else here <clears throat> so keep on nurturing this mindset your your mindset is regarding money is beautiful at this time and it's prosperous that's what the message is from universe okay yeah we have two of oh two oh, oh, oh we have two of wands and three of wands here wands energy the fire energy so whatever you're planning you're preparing keep on moving forward with it because it's going to work out in your favor so if your plan is to quit your job and make money in a different way yes you can do it you can do anything because right now uh, you you know that you don't thrive when you're caged you thrive when you're out of that cage right so you were caged with your mindset somehow somewhere with our pro, uh, pro, poverty mindset or we feel like if i quit this job i might not have that much resources so i will not make it so i need to stay in this job that doesn't give me that fulfillment right but now you're like no i'm i'm out of this i'm ending this chapter of my life where i'm working on this job i'm just going to get out of it and do something that i love and as you plan you prepare the world is in your hands guys you know what's best for you Uh, so really it feels like even if you're quitting your job and doing something entirely different the money is going to flow don't worry about money don't let money stop you from doing something that you love here i feel like that is the latest news for you guys from universe because you have it in you you have the fire you have the passion uh, you can make your dreams come true you have that potential here i feel like you are like the hippopotamus who doesn't give up If you think that you are meant to do this, you will do it and you will achieve it. But only the problem with you guys is like sometimes you don't set your mind to certain things. You become inconsistent, right? So consistency is very much required. You have a very good, healthy, uh, prosperous mindset. But when when it comes to your work, when it comes to taking action and planning and preparing, there is inconsistency. So please work on that. That is the only obstacle right now in your path. is inconsistency yeah or maybe sometimes inconsistency can lead to you know procrastination can lead to in, in, inconsistency and i feel like sometimes this procra- procrastination can many people might have told you that you're lazy as well because of it because you have so much potential guys group number 0 you have a lot of potential you can make your make your dream life come true you can make anything come true but inconsistency is something that you've got to work on it and sometimes the all or nothing mindset can also um make you feel like that i'm not going to have all this so let me not do anything but that mindset is something that we have to work on so being consistent consistent is important you have been consistent with your thought patterns right uh, with your mindset but now get consistent with your planning 
now get consistent with your action okay and there is a lot of travel as well for you guys maybe you will be having a trip and when you're going for a trip if you're planning a trip i even feel like there will be money coming to you maybe <laughs> someone will offer money or some some extra money will come for you for the trip yeah as you plan money is going to come money is not the issue here i, I feel like that uh, it's more sometimes you're not consistent with your actions so please that's that i feel like that's one thing uh, universe is telling you uh, to work on so let's see what else here <clears throat> group number zero. Oh, we have the thinking man again it feels like i'm getting the word alchemist here when i saw this it feels like this person is looking at the crystal and uh, and he's like thinking something like i can you know with this with the help of this crystal i can create something else right i have this small product and i can create something amazing out of it like something from scratch you can create and it can it can give you so much of abundance you have that potential here that's what it is so use your potential to your advantage this lack of inconsistency lack of action is what is coming in between your growth right so sometimes i uh, you take action for a while then you stop i really feel like this group is inconsistent with their efforts right i'm not saying that you're not hard working you are hard working people but if you don't see that fast progress you stop or you you sometimes make excuses like ah oh, this is not the time i'll do it later please don't whenever you get an idea be passionate go for it that dedication is what is required at this time if you have that dedication your mindset is awesome now <laughs> yeah you don't have to work on it because it's already like you are you have you have you have that code right your code is prosperous code now um <laughs> it feels like an app is there and that app you know it really i'm getting this analogy of like apps so computers right if you look at computer we go for an app and we click the app like in mobile we click the app we get the function right we get the result like that you you have this a code prosperous code so your mindset is very prosperous at this time use it to your advantage take action without action nothing will happen so be consistent the more you're consistent you're going to get amazing results so if that means you want to quit your job and do something entirely different you can have it and you can go for it and money will flow but if you are inconsistent so maybe there will be delays there maybe you will be doubting yourself and you will not be able to quit your job and do something that makes you happy so only the problem is your doubt here i see that and the action you know the action is needed here <clears throat> you think you take plan you take action but maybe sometimes you just stop there with the thinking you think 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 never take action that is not going to give you results okay so let's see uh, group number zero what else is the latest news for you guys from the universe uh, latest news the june month popped up maybe something uh, is there for you guys with the june month <clears throat> okay we have the dragon beware of self delusion you will receive a gift oh you will receive it there is definitely money coming towards you with the gift and all okay and the self uh, again look we have new job and career is there so again something it's uh, it's about a uh, you know self doubt that can stop us from taking action maybe self doubt can be the reason of your inconsistency or pr procrastination uh, so that's where you need to be beware, beware of and please believe in yourself let go of that self doubt okay work on that work on your inconsistency you know write a list of the things that you are uh, you want to do it you think about it but you never take action that's where you are inconsistent or maybe you take action for a while then you stop why you stop it's mainly because of the doubt or maybe you're not getting the results as you want <clears throat> so let's see what is the final message for group number 0 yeah and again it it really feels like you're so so afraid of the unsuccessful plans like if i plan this what if it doesn't work out so it's better not to start it so you think about something you know that you have the potential to make it but you are like oh what if it doesn't work out so let me just stop it no don't be like that that is the only thing that is stopping you that is your illusion like delusion that 
it will not work out it will if you have if you try if you keep moving forward you can make anything come true at this time because you have an amazing mindset here prosperous mindset okay group number 0 that's the message that is why it is news for you guys from universe hope it made sense hope it resonated if it did give me a thumbs up i'll see you soon bye bye if the last digit of your birth year is number 1 then this reading is for you so latest news from the universe what is the latest news uh, or maybe you have chosen using this image then also let's see what is the latest news for group number 1 from universe okay latest news for group number 1 i just heard feeding birds uh, like feeding birds a uh, feeding cats you know animals will be very good deed that you can do or if you are already doing it that's such an amazing thing that you do because when you are kind to animals when you're kind to people it actually you know you it gives your soul so much of happiness doing that kind of work small small charity work you know the charity work uh, shouldn't be always with money it can be with um you know complimenting someone or being there for someone hugging someone yeah, again it can be anything be showing up for other people it can be like you giving your energy it really makes you happy when you are very kind it really makes to, makes you happy so please focus more on that kind of energy here or maybe for some of you the latest news i'm even getting is like there is there is some form of kindness that you will experience that might change the way of your thinking here okay yeah so let's see yeah oh wow your family is safe that is one thing uh, your, your uh, universe is want want wants you to know that your family is safe your roots are stronger your family tree like your your the roots that you have planted is very strong your tree is not going to fall down you're all safe you're all protected divine is taking care of you universe has your back group number 1 um are you worried about something are you worried about your loved ones if that is the case universe is telling you don't worry they are looking after you they are looking after your family your loved ones are safe protected a guarded you are safe protected guarded your children are safe protected and guarded yeah guarded okay uh, so something with safety security maybe you are worried about something regarding your family or something like that but everything is safe and secure that's uh, that is the news uh from universe here uh, there is more to the picture that you're not seeing here there is more to come more information to come so don't worry have faith okay so let's see group number 1 there is a lot of light oh your uh, you know if you look at your in envelope it had that light so again and it's a hand like universe has your back universe has your support they're showing you that light uh, maybe you're looking somewhere else here at this time so this is the message your latest news for group number 1 so let's see group number 1 if your last digit of the birth year is 1 let's see what is the message your group number 1 I'm just going to say group number one, okay? Because that's easy. So let's see. Um, we have a main male. Uh, so maybe you're worried about someone in your family who is a male figure. Uh, he is going to be safe. He's going to be protected. Uh, maybe uh, there, uh, you know, money. Uh, maybe this is your spouse. You're mar- worried about their career or something like that. There is more to the picture. There is more information that will come. So don't worry at this time. They will be okay. They will be secure. Again, if this uh, the uh, the this person is your is the family's bread be- breadwinner, and everything is going to be safe, secure. Uh, there is nothing to worry about. Okay, if they, it's about their health, uh, anything like that, nothing to worry about. Uh, that's what universe is uh, telling you at this time. so maybe they have left maybe for some of you maybe your spouse it's it feels like this is someone else for some of you it's like your spouse or maybe your father figure or your son um yeah or someone who you who you really think highly of um maybe they are going through a tough time at this time and the latest news maybe you have been praying for them something like that i feel like you're a very kind soul <laughs> and yeah maybe that's that's why i was talking about kindness here so maybe you have been praying for them and they will be okay they will be fine yeah there is more to the picture there is more information that uh, that will come so don't worry okay yeah <clears throat> so let's see what else here's the latest news from the universe um yeah dream oh uh, yes maybe for some of you yeah challenge here yes 
so again this is someone you really love and maybe they are going through a challenge they have a dream and now you're say finding that, that that this person has a challenge maybe a health issue maybe maybe they have lost their job maybe their dream job uh, yeah something with their dream there has been an issue right and um and and i feel like here the message is like nothing to worry about because there is more to the picture here but you guys are not seeing at the correct time correct place here there is more information so if something has gone that doesn't mean that dream has gone right it can be you also this main male you can be also the person who has felt like that that your dreams have uh, gone now you, you like yeah sometimes you feel like our dreams are crushed nothing will work out nothing like that at this time your roots are very strong or maybe this is your loved ones of yours who are going through a tough time feeling that dreams will never come true or something like that that's not the truth at all here there is more to the picture and right now you are all safe protected that's what the message that's what universe wants you to know i feel like that's the news here uh, more information will come later but at this time this is all you need just to know group number 1 let's see there is light coming don't worry we have taking risk oh wow look success there is more information coming here soon this person will be taking a risk and that will lead to the success their dreams are not crushed here their dreams are not crushed here so whenever you're praying if this is another person whenever you're praying for them see them in success don't see them worrying don't see them stress stress see them in high regards see them uh, facing their fears and taking up on challenges and moving forward right because they will be successful in it so as i mentioned right now uh, you or this person doesn't have that clear picture there is more to the situation there is more information that will be coming in and as those information come i feel like this person will be taking charge or it's you if it's you you will be taking charge and you're going to get the success that you want here so your dreams are not crushed or this person's dream is not crushed um yeah there is more more to the picture and things are going to work out but yes there uh, the truth is going to come the truth has you have not seen the truth or this person has not seen the tr truth he, uh, again uh, as i mentioned your loved ones are all all doing well like they they are all protected you universe has their back here so uh, so right now what 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 needs to be done is to not focus on the negativity even though things are not working out the way it it should work out uh, so don't focus on those kinds of uh, negative feelings or poverty kind of feelings like i I'm, i'm not getting going to get success or maybe if it's your spouse don't don't see them in um, misery or see them like they are coming out of that situation rising above and getting that success because that success is assured here but yes um there is more to the picture and as they get the information they will be taking the taking the risk right sometimes we have to take the risk to get a success right uh, and your dreams are not crushed and i feel like that's all universe wants to let you know at this time um so let's see yeah you will be soon moving away from the situation this is like instability you will be moving away from this instability or this person will be moving away from this instability so again uh, for some of you because of uh, because you are a family maybe this person is going through something that means you are also going through something because it it might be affecting you as well if someone in your family who is bringing money right is losing their job it will affect the whole family right and it can um, you know it can come in between your dreams maybe you had dream to go somewhere else or maybe you had a dream of uh, traveling it all will mess up right but nothing to worry about this instable situation is there for only a temporary time and there is some sort of information coming and that, that at that time this person will take the unnecessary steps that is needed and they will get the success so don't worry okay what you can do if this is about other person see them winning visualize them winning getting their dreams come true don't see them in misery don't see them um uh failing so i always talk about how we pray i feel like joseph murphy talks about it and many times when we pray we see that person uh in a negative way so for example if you are worried about your kids see them winning don't see them failing we are sometimes we see the worst case scenario don't do that okay so and this tough times will be over and this you're going to move away or uh, you as a family or this person is going to move away from that so don't worry okay latest news from the universe
Yeah, wow. Look, again, you have to be the strong pillar, I feel like that at this time. You have to have that kind of strength at this time, right? Uh, that That's what you need to do here. Because again, we have the seven of um, uh, swords, energy, uncertainty, but there is more to the picture. A lot of things are hidden at this time. You don't have the clear picture. This person doesn't have the clear picture. Soon you will be getting out of this this energy so right now if this is about other person what you need to be is like the queen of wands to have that faith even though even in tough times have that faith uh, yes because here universe is assuring you that you and your loved ones are going to be safe so be strong at this time give that strength to this person and if you're the one have that strength you can make it but mostly I feel like this is uh, this is like it's not about you this is someone else in your family getting affected with something. They are feeling very unstable and it's affecting you as well. It's making you feel down as well. But you have to, you know, you have to rise above that and give them that strength and motivation that they might be lacking at this time. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. Uh, so let's see group number one. What else here? Latest news from the universe. So we have, wow, we have the goddess of the moon here. Uh, and look again rest and rejuvenation so calm down guys nothing to worry about and i feel like you're someone you are someone who is very intuitive who is very connected to their soul and that's the reason um they're telling you to just calm down be their strength because you know there is more to the picture and and i even feel like in your dream maybe there will be something shown to you guys that will help this person in the coming days maybe you will be the one getting a message for them so please track your dreams write down the messages you're receiving in your dreams write down your dreams because as you write down as you sit with it you might get some sort of information that will not only not only benefit them it will benefit you as well uh, so yes you might be getting some sort of information uh, that will help this person maybe it will feel risky but yeah, for some of you, it might feel risky to share that. Share your dream and tell them that. No, no, no. Don't feel that. Just share it. Yes, in your dreams, there is information coming here. So that, as I, as I mentioned, there was something hidden. It Because it's different for everyone, you might be receiving that information in your dreams or it is like a click that you will have. Like again, yeah, the message came. It's just like it's a confirmation. Like a, like a message will come out of nowhere. You will feel like, ah, oh, let's let do this, do that share that because it will uh, it will be beneficial yeah you're very intuitive trust your intuition trust that idea trust that message okay so so right now just get relaxed you know don't worry nothing is going to be wrong everything will work out right that's what i'm getting here dream okay dream journal have a dream journal if you already don't maybe for some of you have already gotten that dream maybe you're thinking about that dream uh, so just sit with the dream because there is a message in that dream if you have already received that dream <clears throat> so let's see what else here so take note of your dreams guys in the coming days i'll recommend that um so let's see final messages for group number one we have a rabbit oh rabbit too much concern with sexual matters Again, it, rabbit can be the worry, you know, worry, worry energy. In this, I'm getting that worry energy here too much, too much thinking about one thing all, all the time. Yes, again, this person might be thinking something that is worrying them too much. So uh, instead of worrying, focus on the solution. And I feel like if this is about your spouse, you are the one who, who is getting that message here. And uh, maybe this is you. Uh, I feel like it's uh, that then that means it's time to be strong and not to worry about this thing rather take a step back relax connect with your intuition because there is messages universe is giving you at this time that will really help you that will really help you with your success so an idea that might come might feel like challenging but take action because it will feel right okay so let's see group number one so yeah you will get out of this situation <laughs> Definitely, there is a tough situation. I see that right right now. You will be getting out of that situation. Great happiness. Oh, look, um, an arrogant, peaceful person you should not cross. So there is some sort of issues in you or your partner's life or your family, loved one, someone's loved one. And they are going to get out of that situation very soon. 
uh, there is more information that is coming that's why a uh, universe is telling you to uh, you know trust your intuition relax at this time so you can connect with your intuition and um, and there is like great happiness entering so don't worry too much at this time everything is going to be okay your loved ones are safe and uh, if it yeah it can be about you it can be about a person but mostly i'm feeling it's about a loved one because we got this uh, charm and this charm so maybe they are not seeing uh, that much they are focused too much on worry um and so please guide them uh, be strong for them at this time and that's what i'm getting here because don't worry you will be this person will be getting out of the situation very very soon and that, that is going to lead to something amazing that you never thought or that this person never thought okay so that's all i have for you guys group number 1 hope it made sense hope it resonated if it did give me a thumbs up I'll see you soon. Bye bye. Hello. If you, the last digit of your birth year is number two, then this is me, this is the message for you. This latest news from the universe for you, and or maybe you have been attracted to this image. Then then also it's your reading. So if you are drawn intuitively, uh, then group number two. I'll be uh, I'll be saying group number two. Okay. So let's see what is the message. Latest news for you guys from universe. <coughs> listen to your body guys listen to your body your body is speaking to you guys don't force your body to do certain things when it doesn't want to to do so certain times we pressure ourselves even we are not feeling it even our body is tired and we know it we sometimes force ourselves stop forcing your body if your body needs a break if your body needs a rest please show your body some love some compassion give that rest okay group number 2 let's see what else <clears throat> oh wow okay yeah yeah again you know i was talking about the rest here maybe for some of you we have the cat and we have the mic maybe a little bit of a break is required from talking uh, from yeah from doing content maybe for someone who 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 speaks a lot maybe your work required speaking if you are someone who is a communicator or something like that maybe you need a real little bit of break here and if you are someone who overshares maybe you need to take a step back with that as well uh, maybe you need to um look at how you speak to yourself how you speak about other people yeah to other people are you constantly complaining uh, if if there is something like that this is the time to take a break okay guys maybe you complain you complain you complain and then you show up show up you don't listen to your body this is the time to not complain rather look oh I, am i feeling great do i need a break ask yourself maybe sometimes that job you have to go to the job and every time we complain about that job instead of taking a break you know reflecting on certain things we just keep moving keep moving keep going keep going we keep speaking instead of doing that maybe right now why not like that we take a step 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 back we sit down with ourselves we give our body that grace that love we sit with ourselves so we know what we need to do right so so yes again you know the jaguar here it feels like when they go hunting they take a two steps back and then they know exactly where they need to make that jump this is what this is what is required for you guys group number 2 um yeah maybe for some of you as you go go uh, take those steps back two steps back your whole foundation will be shaken you will feel like oh maybe i don't want to do this but like the dragon you are going to rise above as well those two steps that you will be taking back will actually help you to jump ahead in your life so <clears throat> that's what is required don't feel like when you take a break things will crash no no things are not going to crash if you take two steps back actually you will move forward that's what that's what it is you will be able to uh, you know recharge and you will be able to be very you know you will be able to do more because your body will be recharged right now i really really feel like that um there is something that you have to think about you're just showing up for the sake of showing up and it's not making you happy you know it reminds me of my job uh i was not loving that job it was very stressful and when i you know too much of work was there and i was not giving myself break and i was always sick also at that time you know because there was too much going on too much stress too much work um and 
and what i'm getting is like uh, i'm what i'm getting is like when i got my first salary at that time after uh, work, working for a month i was not happy when i received the money i was not happy and that's the indication that it's not working you try you try you show up every day but if you're even getting a payoff and you're not happy that means you have to think about it right like why i'm not happy what i should do like i need to take a break for that right yeah so this is the scenario i'm getting a person who is not happy who's just doing complaining all the time the way you're thinking about it or, or talking to other people is also like that so what do you need to do at this time is like give yourself some grace take two steps back even though you now you might feel like oh taking two steps back is a bad thing no it's not a bad thing it's like taking two steps sitting with yourself sitting you know looking at the whole picture and yeah as you take those two steps back the certain foundations that you have created might crash down but that that's okay because now as you take two steps back you analyze everything and then you know exactly when you need to give your energy and once you do that that's when the jump big jump happens and you keep moving forward and that's when you move forward in a way that really really makes you happy here yeah, i feel like your body is showing you signs regarding something that it's not working and you need to take a break yes that means your foundation will be shaken up because you have you're letting go of something that is that that you thought is good for you right your whole foundation will be shaked up shaking up but do you want to be in that energy where you're feeling off all the time or you want to take two steps back and analyze everything and do something that really really connects with you and makes you happy makes your body energized right your body is speaking to you group number 2 are you avoiding it how how are you feeling great when you go to a job or, or are you just complaining like something is there in in any area it can be right how you are communicating to other people about that area you know you know you know it right yeah so let's see um <clears throat> taking two steps back is not failure it's actually um it's actually power you know it's it's actually courageous things thing to do take a break now yeah so you will come 10 times stronger guys that's what universe wants you to know at this time so that's the latest message your latest news for group number 2 yeah wow it will concern you at this time <laughs> look again falseness is there mm, look again these two are the confirmation as what i was talking this is like a false perception you have made that this will give me happiness so i'm going to try i'm going to try i'm i'm I'll act i will like that i love it i love it and at the end you don't love it you don't like it you don't like the energy your body is giving you signs that this is fake this is not nice you you're feeling that concern you're complaining about it right this is like a false person and you have created like this is very good for me this is a very good relationship for me but at the same time when you're with that person you are not feeling great but you act like i'm free feeling great you act and act and act and you know that it's not it's not working so as you take two steps back you are going to understand why you were feeling like that because that person might not be truthful because yeah again it can be like the job uh, yeah the job is not for you maybe you will realize something that is of concern but it's better than to be in that falseness than to see the truth right sorry what i said <laughs> it's better to know the falseness yeah yeah like it's better to know the truth than to be in the falseness that's what i was telling okay i'm sorry for that yeah it's, so it's better to know the true colors than to be in that uh, illusion all the time isn't it so like that even though it might be of message of concern even yeah it might feel like oh my god this is not working for me like as you take those two steps back you will be like yeah maybe if it's a relationship and you're taking two steps back and you're just taking a break and you're away with this uh, away from this person and then you're analyzing everything like all the details that happened for the past uh, two years or two months whatever it is right and you're like oh my god i have not i'm so feeling good right now when i'm not with this person so it's like this concern will come out of your you like oh my god i'm actually enjoying without being in that relationship i'm actually feeling great my body is feeling great so it feels like the truth might hurt you but at the same time you know that that's what you need right the truth is what you need so you can let go of that falseness here so yeah so you can jump to to a place where you're going to get that kind of happiness that you want here 
to focus on something that you really want to grow in your life here so you can come out of that false mess here so yes and whenever we know the truth it can be better sometimes it can it can pull us down but it can shake our foundation but isn't it better to get out of it rather than staying there right so yeah so let's see group number 2 you cannot act anymore you need to show again it can be like you acting like oh this is okay this is okay this is okay i'll do it i'll do it but now it's starting affect it, it has started to affect your health your well being your mental health and you're like no i cannot i cannot force any anymore so you have to take that step back yeah <clears throat> and we have the patience i feel like uh, the patience came in reverse as well so you have been very patient with this thing you think that this will work out i will be motivated i'll do it i'll do it i'll do it it's like the motivation that you were giving to yourself yeah it feels like you 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 thought that this will work out you know sometimes we give too much energy to certain things and then and then there comes a point we are where we understand no matter how patient i am no matter how hard i work this is not going to work out for me this relationship is not going to work out for me i need to take a new path and that's exactly it is it is it is difficult to take a new path but is it for the best yes so i really feel like that you have been very patient but this is not changing so it's it's time that you take two steps back and seek a new direction here that's what universe is telling you okay <clears throat> to make the change something needs to change okay so let's see it can be about a love situation or it can be about work situation as well it can be anything but you have been act, like you have been trying really hard and as you were trying really hard you were not authentic to you or maybe yeah that's what it is it feels like you were trying too hard and it didn't feel right and you tried tried and your body started showing you signs that yeah that it's not for you or something like that um yeah so let's see yeah we have a community yeah oh wow we have the butterflies and the rainbows uh, <clears throat> so the support that you want as you're going through this right i, I really feel like that so maybe you will be um yeah you will be cutting something you will be letting go of something because this is not suitable for you guys right but don't worry because there is universe supporting you there is people there are people who will support you actually so as you let go of this thing you're going to meet the right people as well so uh, this can be a relationship again false person you're getting some sort of information regarding that person so you have to choose a new direction so i will give you an example that i'm getting here you were with a person who has all those sweet words to say they were always wearing that mask and saying that sweet words to you right and only sweet words were there there was no action so you your body was speaking up on it right you didn't feel that safety with them but their words were very safe so your mind was like ah oh, this person is like this this person loves me because they always might say that they love you but there was no action so your body picked up on it and you didn't feel that safety with that person so you kept going then there might be a time someone said that showed you the truth like who this person is so you were very patient with this person for so so long so long and now you're choosing yourself and as you choose yourself as you get back to you know take two step back take a break and you know exactly where you need to make the jump so you're making that jump you're not going to be alone there are people that is the good news here you will not be alone there will be the support right support right people will find you as you want that you will be getting that okay <clears throat> there is definitely change seeing the bigger picture and making that change for your own good yeah uh so let's see what else here group number 2 latest message for you guys oh we have eight of wands yes okay i really feel like that once you take a step back you will know you will see things very very clearly and you will know exactly what you want and what you don't want and you will be moving in the di right direction very very soon here so again we have patience you have been patient for so so long you didn't yeah again you were so patient 
you were so so patient but that patient didn't work out it just made you feel stuck sometimes patient yeah sometimes being patient with other person who is not showing up is just a waste of time you're understanding it you're changing your direction and things are moving fast for you as you're meeting the right people you're getting maybe for some of you quit this job and you get a job that you love very fast right again it, uh, it can be like you could you, you break take a break from this relationship and you meet the right people right friends right friend group i'm not saying that you will go you know after one relationship to another very fast maybe for some of you you might you might feel, uh, find someone who will acknowledge you appreciate you that can also be there but <clears throat> maybe this will start with a friendship then only it will move to a relationship but definitely uh, things will start speeding up for you guys here because you will be in the right energy you will be feeling good so things will also move forward in your life <clears throat> you're going to see more hope as you get out of this thing more hope more rest more love i feel like that more people who really shows up you're going to see people if they want to show up they will show up if they don't want to show up they will not show up right so you had been with this person who didn't show up but if they love you if they want you they are going to show up and you're going to meet those kinds of people <coughs> wow look we have <laughs> the victory card as well yes look at it you have been hanged for so long like again the hanged man you have been stuck there now you are seeing a complete different view like why i am stuck here oh this is the reason because i'm listening to this person and not trusting my body and now i'm going to do what feels right to me not for the person i'm not going to stop myself i'm going to listen to my body so like that you're taking the two steps back like the jaguar you're making the jump and as you make the jump things move fast that's exactly that's what is going to happen here okay that's what the message is that will lead to your victory with the speed and eight of wands and with six of wands again the fire energy things will be so fast <clears throat> so let's see wow look caring connections yes oh that's such a big confirmation so from uh, yeah from yeah again it feels like you were not in a connection that was caring enough like as i mentioned if people you you're going to meet the people who will show up if they, if someone loves you and want to show up will show up they are not going to make excuses you have heard enough of those excuses right and that's the thing so as you take a step back you understand your own value like this is not for me i'm just letting go of it you let go of it and things start moving forward for you very fast and for some of you yes you will get to a relationship that will be so caring and this will not be like that per person at all they will be very different they will show up they will show up in the way you know they will show it like they will take action they are not a full of words it's very easy to say things and not do it this is a person who will show up who will show like they they care through their actions wow okay so have the courage guys uh, you are a courageous person and yes it's tough but it's better to not be in that shaky environment for uh, for the whole life right it's better to let go of that thing and move forward right and that's exactly what's happening here you're finding people good people good community right oh wow we have dog right protection from a, for a powerful friend again dogs are so loyal right you're going to meet those kinds of people who are loyal who will stick to it best companion <clears throat> best friendships the people who protect you you're getting there wow <clears throat> so we have yeah wow okay <laughs> as i mentioned you like solid foundation success with effort we have the tower and i did mention like the tower like letting go of that tower that is shaky so you can create someone a uh, very uh, create something that is the foundation where it's going to be so strong and it's not going to fall apart so that's what it is yeah um yes you will be doing that that's what the message is for my lovely group number 2 hope it made sense hope it resonated if it give me a thumbs up i'll see you soon bye bye hello if the last digit of your birth year is number 3 then this is the reading for you or if you have chosen using this image then also this reading is for you so let's talk about the latest news from the universe for my lovely group number 3 
Oh yeah. Okay. So let's see. Uh, let's see what is for group number three. Okay. I'm hearing the word carnelian, the carnelian crystal, and I feel like that crystal uh, goes with the confidence. Be confident in yourself. Okay. Confidence is the key to your success here. Um, and I even feel like if you are someone who has been feeling that confident, you're going to see the results of your confidence. You will see how the confidence can attract so many good things. How confidence can attract uh, attract results that you didn't get before so here uh, universe is reminding you that your confidence is your key to success okay so let's see group number three what is the message here latest news from the universe hmm wow we have a star 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 <laughs> And we have the flower. Um, so maybe for some of you, a dream, a cherished dream of yours is going to come true. And as again, it feels like a person who is speaking that dream into existence, who is believing in that dream, speaking about it, talking about it in a very positive manner. Even when they didn't have the dream, they were feeling that confidence, like I'm going to have it. I'm going to have it. Right. I have already made it like that kind of energy, that confidence of yours that you have showed. You are going to see the results here. That's the latest news. Your confidence. You know, some, sometimes we have to feel that confidence in ourselves. Like, I can make it. I can do it. This dream of mine, I have it in me. Yeah, I have it. I have all that in me. So I can get that dream. I'm worthy of that dream. You felt it. And finally, you're getting it. Yeah. Because you have taken that power back. Right. You've taken that control. Sometimes we give control to our emotions. We sometimes give control to the daily life, how we feel, you know, sometimes emotionally we take that, we, we give that control to our emotions. Rather here, I feel like you've taken control of your emotions. Yeah. Sometimes we feel like we, we are not doing enough or we are not doing good, but you changed it. You, felt, you changed it and you took that power and you're like, I'm going to do this. I'm going to try that and I'm going to make my dreams come true. Like that energy you have been in for a very long time, even if things were challenging, you took your power back again and again and again and that's the reason of you getting your dreams come true so a dream of yours is manifesting that is the news a dream of yours that you have been cherishing you have been protecting you have been working really really hard on you have been feeling that confidence confidence like you have been giving your best to that dream in order to fulfill that dream that dream is going to be fulfilled Okay, so let's see. It feels like you you have a uh, universe is telling you like you have spoken this dream to into existence. You have been spoken speaking about that dream to you your yourself in a very positive way, and you have made it happen. Okay, um, yeah. Okay, so let's see for group number three. What else is the message here? Latest news from the universe. Latest news from the universe. Again, I'm hearing speaking into existence, like courthouse. Look again, you know, um, um, uh, if there is some sort of courthouse issues that is going to be solved, I even feel like that you might have like rehearsed in mirror, like this judgment is on your side. Like you might have pictured that. I feel like this reality that you're getting, you have spoken, spoken into existence, something like that. Why I'm getting like that words? You have been, you have, you have speaking it in a way that brought this reality to your, your life because you were speaking it in a very positive way. You wanted this thing. You spoke like that and you got it. You didn't speak it in a way, uh, in a negative way. You spoke it in the way that you wanted it confidently and you're getting it. So yeah, that's what it is. So it feels like, again, the courthouse, you know, in the courthouse, what happens if you have a case, uh, two parties are going to fight. And one will get the, yeah, uh, get uh, the one's result will be in favor, right? And that's exactly, you are the one who is winning the case. You are getting your dreams. So that's what it is. You have been, uh, like, again, it feels like you, you uh, again, it really feels like you have been speaking to yourself in a way that is bringing this achievement into your life, this dream of yours. Because you, the way you have been speaking it, it was so beautiful. So yeah, so universe is giving you that judgment that is going to be in your favor here. Yeah, things are going to change afterwards because now what you wanted is in your hands. Like again, it's in your favor. Uh, so 
So let's see. Wow, fun time. Hmm. Look again. Now you can celebrate this thing. So th things have been really toxic for you guys, right? So there has been a person who was toxic or maybe there's this, this whole thing that was happening. It was very toxic. But you didn't give energy to that toxicity. You took your control back and you fed yourself with that positive energy you as i as i mentioned you were speaking yourself you know to yourself in a way where you're feeling like this is mine this thing that i want is mine like you were you were feeling that confidence and finally it's yours and you did really work uh, you know i feel like you visualized it you you know sometimes we take action but if we don't have that kind of uh positive energy we don't get that kind of uh results that we want but here at this time what you did is you did your best and you had that faith right you kept that positivity you had that confidence in yourself and that's giving you that kind of result that you always wanted that wish that you always wanted so now so now you can relax and have more fun time more leisure time because this thing is coming into fruition okay so let's see group number three so things are really getting better for you guys more fun you will be you will be smiling more you will be happy more yeah yeah <laughs> look we have the change yes again things are changing uh, and uh, we have this change here as well back of the deck energy yes <clears throat> you know before many times what happens in life we kind of expect the worst case scenarios maybe you were that kind of person who used to think in a very negative way way but you have changed that now you are thinking in a very positive way in a very confident way and you are seeing that results as well right so you're seeing the change you're going to see the change that you always wanted to see in your life maybe this was a very big dream that 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 was in your heart for a very long time but it didn't, didn't it didn't come true but finally as you're becoming confident as i mentioned speaking into existence that is the word that is speaking this thing into existence that is what is popping up in my head again and again and again that's why i've been talking about it so much in this reading because it will speak this you you spoke this thing into existence because you you did it right and now you're seeing the change yes look we have abundance lot of growth happiness here you'll be happy yeah um and this will this will shift many things in your life because now you understand the power of the universe you will understand the the power of positive thinking right hmm so let's see group number 3 justice again we have this court house and justice so this is in an area of your of your life where you had felt that kind of despair because nothing was working in your favor always you might have felt unjustified you might have caught in that injustice all the time in this area of your life now you're getting the justice now it's in your favor now the scales have been balanced here so something yeah again this is an area of your life where you always felt unjustified even though you did your work but you never got the results that you wanted finally the justice is in your sight you're getting the justice you're getting your good karma here okay yeah things are going to be balanced that's a huge confirmation okay so let's see wow oh yes yeah, so you're going to be in your power here <laughs> yeah you have been hurt so many times right because you didn't get this thing you might have felt that hurt that pain that loss no matter what you do you never win you might have felt no matter what you do you did, didn't get the result the judgment that you wanted right but finally that's changing for you guys you will be feeling in your power you will be feeling so happy you that's why this fun you will be so relaxed so happy that you got this thing and the way it happened the way you changed your thinking right and that will really really alter the way you think about you your life and that will change your uh, life in an amazing way so your future is also going to change because of this thing because you're getting this thing and you will understand like how you how you were the one who who brought it into your life through the words of positivity right the way you spoke about it changed so that's why so this thing is not only going to get you this thing right this dream you're getting this dream but the way you got this dream is going to change your whole life because your perception regarding life is going to change 
you will feel so much in power you will feel so much like yeah that i have control of my emotions and i can make my dreams come true you the way you will think about yourself is going to shift and that's going to change your life for the better right <clears throat> so let's see what else here yeah oh my god this is what you're coming out of financial constraints you know sometimes the way we think about money can pop up again and again same thing the more we think about the money in lack form we are going to get it so you have done the work you have shifted something right in your uh, mindset where you were not you are where you are not focusing on the lack rather you are focusing on the abundance and that's the result you will be getting so again this 13 number is talking about the death right the death card in the tarot is the number 13 and the 13 here yeah so that's the thing that uh, that's the end of this of the injustice that you were feeling now you're getting the justice right so money wise there will be increase because you have worked on your mindset or maybe if there is some sort of court issue regarding money the, that will be in your favor you will be getting the money that is also there look happy family you will be happy right wow <clears throat> so good times happy times are uh, as written for you guys and uh, the way because you have shifted so much about regarding your thinking right so let's see group number 3 what else your final messages Hmm. Wow. Oh my God. Something important, such as a new job or a raise. Definitely, I did mention here. Um, something is going to work out in your favor. A dream is coming true. So that if it's like a raise that you want, job that you want, that will make you more money. That's all is coming in your favor here. Yep. <clears throat> yeah. Uh, someone is trying to come between you and a friend or something you want again this wedge it's like our thoughts sometimes comes in between our own desires isn't it many times you have worked on it and you've let it go here and now this is not going to bother you anymore here yeah okay wow marriage oh marriage okay so again we have this happy family here and marriage so maybe there was a little bit of struggle in your marriage um because of finances right or maybe this is some sort of marriage court house justice maybe some of you are getting married that is a change here but again marriage maybe in marriage there were issues with finances that is going to be uh, getting better right the um, yeah maybe as you work on your lack mindset as your spouse works on their like lack mindset things are getting better and if you do uh, like had problems with someone um, and they were not giving the money you're getting the money your marriage is actually becoming more stronger and that's what i'm getting here uh, so that's all i have for group number 3 hope it made sense hope it resonated if it did give me a thumbs up i will see you soon bye bye take care the last digit of your birth year is number 4 then this is your message or if you have been uh, attracted to this image then also it's your message so let's see latest news from the universe for group number 4 i'm seeing elephant maybe uh, obstacles are being going to be lifted from your path if there were certain obstacles in your way i feel like the obstacles are going to be lifted and one more message is to be uh, to care for the ones who you love and maybe there is a person who really really loves you but they they don't share through their words but they might share through their actions acknowledge them spend time with them so spend time with your loved ones that is also there okay so let's see group number 4 what is the latest news for you guys from the universe i'm seeing horse movement progress oh wow yeah Oh look we have a star here or oh, you're glowing up i feel like with this mirror maybe for some of you you are using mirror work and you are you're working on your confidence you're committed to it i see there is this glow up happening with the peacock and the star um yeah so you might be investing in yourself and that's an amazing thing to do you're investing in your clothes maybe you're investing in new makeup maybe you're investing on uh, hair care right you you know you're spending some money on your hair care so there is this major glow up so your your commitment to yourself is paying off maybe you're committed to uh, you know working on yourself um with this mirror work i see that you're 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 committing to be confident right you're committing to not self sabotage yourself uh, you're committing to uh, to not to not self doubt yourself you committing to listening to your heart nurturing yourself and all those is, is paying off you're going to shine like the peacock your personality is going to shine i feel like people will be loving your vibe your yeah it feels like you are going to um turn head, like you wherever you go people will be turning heads looking at you so the investments that you had done on yourself is going to pay off 
so maybe you, it can be a goal that you have been working on and now finally you are seeing the results happening now you can share that news with your loved ones uh, so maybe there's this thing this work that you have been doing with yourself it feels like some of you have been uh, reading a lot of self help books maybe yeah maybe working on yourself you have healing your inner child you have been working on yourself and all those results of that work is going to show up because you you the way you show up is different you're showing yourself confidently you're not doubting yourself for small small things you're not craving that validation from other people uh, anymore so yeah you 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 it's your glow up era you're glowing up here uh, yes the commitment that you have shown to yourself is showing your results this is your time of glow up your looking like a star <laughs> that's what it is people are noticing you uh, people are loving you uh, for some of you it's your personality shining loud and clear for some of you, you uh, the way you have worked on yourself maybe you have worked on your body uh, your posture or maybe your uh, maybe your communication you, you might have worked on yourself the commitment that you have shown to yourself for a very long time it's showing up and people are going to see that <laughs> yeah you're going to recognize for that yes yeah. okay <clears throat> so let's see group number 4 what is the latest news i feel like this is news is about your glow up <laughs> uh, yeah you are going to get a lot of compliments you walk in the room uh, yeah this hard work the, we have the court house again it feels like uh, the court house two parties are debating and one gets the one gets the judgment right one one once one, it will be in favor of someone right like this it you had this fight between your heart and the mind and finally your heart is going to win you will be seeing that your heart is winning because your heart felt like you have to work on yourself you have to do this and you did it and now you're seeing something that you wish like your heart told you to do and you're doing it and it's coming out in your favor right so yeah okay so let's see <laughs> Uh, what else is for group number four? What is the message? Your latest news from group number four. If you have been waiting on a visa or something like that, or any documents, it is going to come out in your favor. Yeah. If you are waiting for any appointment, appoint, appointments. Oh my God, I can't say that word. Anyways, uh, yeah, it is going to come. You know, you will get that much faster than you expect. Um. So let's see. uh what else here uh, <clears throat> we have creativity wow again it feels like you know what i'm attracted to is this paint paint and it it feels like you know in our life sometimes we listen to other people and paint uh the colors that they like and we make other people sometimes we make other people's colors our favorite colors but then we realize it was not our favorite color and i feel like now you are at this at this uh, at this time of your life where you are understanding your own uh, your own favorite things i feel like that yeah i'm i'm getting that kind of vibe here because you have been working on yourself you are understanding what makes you happy what doesn't make you happy um what feels right to you what doesn't feels right to you uh what brings uh yeah what brings that glow in you you're understanding all those things i i really feel like you're understanding what is your favorite color as well maybe you made someone else's favorite color your favorite color but now you're realizing that color was not your favorite something else was your favorite so you're using now your favorite colors and making a dream life out of it uh really that's what i'm i, I will say one more thing here you know I, i'll go with this example here again this person has this kind of uh, paper right and um, sometimes uh, in life that happens when we are born we are born into a family right we are born and that is not in our hands and that family's uh, rules or traditions that all affect us right sometimes that doesn't stay with us but we feel like that's that's who we are right and we keep doing what they they gave us like subconsciously it happens we take on it and we make the decisions that might not be right for us because we are being conditioned to believe certain things from a childhood from childhood it's like a script that we have been given someone else wrote the things for us and we believe it and we keep living life and now what is happening is you have been working on yourself this group has been doing the inner work so what is it you are finding your true authentic self here 
so i really feel like the conditioning that was given to you guys you're breaking yourself free from it and finding your true personality who you are actually it's like right now only you're finding yourself here so you're you're in this process where you're learning more about yourself that you didn't know you're actually connecting with your soul with your own creativity with your own uniqueness that you suppressed because someone told that it was not nice so you followed their script now you have the script and you know that this is not something i want so you're rewriting your script you're rewriting your story maybe someone told you that you're not beautiful enough so you took that and you thought that you're not beautiful but that was their perception it was not who you are really and now you're understanding that i was beautiful at that time also now also i'm beautiful like you're getting into that energy of loving yourself taking care of yourself feeling alive within yourself because you are now connected to your soul so that's what it is you you will be feeling so alive i feel like that because you will be you you will be your authentic self and you are going to find so much more about yourself you have already found so much so keep doing whatever you're doing because it's definitely working in your favor and you're going to find so much more about yourself that you haven't because you might have suppressed those things about you when you were a child because you might not have gotten that kind of motivation guidance uh, in your childhood so you know sometimes it's very easy to suppress all those things now the the real you is coming out so be kind to yourself more and more kindness is important i feel like you're learning to be kind to yourself not to be harsh on yourself not to self sabotage yourself you're learning that okay so let's see group number 4 what else it's it feels like some of you are in the spiritual journey learning more about yourself who you are so whole concept of you who you thought you were is changing yeah that's what is happening leadership yeah you i feel like you always felt that you're not a leader we have a star here as well <laughs> yeah again um, yes you never thought yourself like a star you never thought that you are beautiful because because the way you were raised you didn't see the good qualities in you you thought that you don't have you have to be the follower you didn't see yourself like a leader that's all changing now you're seeing your own true colors that you kind of suppressed you didn't connect with your soul but now i am seeing that connection with your soul you're connecting with your own divinity you're connecting with your own heart and you're understanding so much about yourself that you didn't understand in the last 30 years 40 years 50 years 20 years i don't know how many years but now you are finding your true authentic self and the best is coming out of you because of the work that you have done right so let's see what the tarot has to add group number 4 three of wands hmm okay that's nice and the price three of wands okay <laughs> look we have look we have the lost the five of swords energy this five of swords energy is a person saying something to hurt us and in that that person is also not winning you are also not winning no one is winning but someone is deeply getting hurt because someone else wanted to win they deeply made other person hurt you have been in this energy for so long that's why you felt like you're not good enough you lack self esteem you didn't have that self worth right because you thought that you're not good enough you thought that you cannot do anything because this person wanted that control right so it can be your parents even without realizing they might have made you feel like that you're not worth it you're useless you know sometimes parents do certain uh, things that really really affect their child even though the parents love them sometimes they realize sometimes they don't realize but sometimes sometimes you know it happens and i feel like it happened with you where they kind of controlled you maybe they didn't appreciate you for who you are maybe they told you that you're not good enough maybe you're not better than your siblings maybe they compared you and it all hurt you when you were a child right and it affected you as you were growing so you didn't make your own plans you didn't have that ambition that other people might have had around you you didn't know what you were who you were you didn't know what to do so you kept following what other people told told to you you kept doing everything that others told you to do and you you now then you found yourself in a life that you were not happy 
then you started doing the work on yourself then you started loving yourself yeah and now what's happening you are in your power you're not giving your power to anyone you're not becoming impulsive you're not making making decisions because someone else told you to do so you're making certain decisions because you know it's best for you so you are becoming your own leader you are becoming your own it it feels like an emperor who is so balanced who is not impulsive who, who knows who they are and they are not going to uh sell themselves for short anymore because they know they are of high value and they are understanding their own potential so they are using it to their advantage here yes okay so let's see group number 4 what else <laughs> look again the garden will gate yes oh wow. again the garden will gate this person has so much potential but they are standing in this garden because someone has might have told them that they cannot get out of the gate even though the key is there in their neck but they don't realize their potential they feel like they're not good enough so they just stand where they feel like it's good even though they're not happy it's like a prison where everything is there but they are not happy because they have not found themselves so they keep following other people because they told it's better but not any more you are you are like seeing the key like this is not me this is not what i am so i'm taking the key i'm getting out of this gate and living a life that gives me happiness i'm becoming the best version of myself and becoming my own leader i'm not following people anymore i'm doing what's best for me yeah i see that here so you connected with archangel gabriel as well i feel like because uh, he is giving you messages maybe you believe in archangel my gabriel maybe you, uh, maybe maybe you uh, call upon him and again archangel gabriel here is with the throat chakra and throat chakra you are expressing yourself speaking up for yourself standing up for yourself who you are it, it, again it's like empowering yourself doing something that makes you happy expressing yourself living a life that you truly desire not others right so let's see the final messages here for group number 4 <clears throat> we have scissors oh disappointment again you're cutting cords with th- that version of you that thought that they are not good enough you're cutting that that version of you from your plate and you're becoming the leader and you're taking charge and it doesn't matter who you were before now you are this you know who you are and now you're taking action so yes i feel like yeah look again you you're getting out of that past you version you're not that past person anymore that has gone that has entered it's that it's like your need rebirth <laughs> and you are ready to do what's best for you yeah you're getting out of that so let's see the Yeah look we have you will be you will be playing a different role here again <laughs> uh we have peace and harmony and again the different role and i was talking about the script someone assigned you a role that was not even something that you liked and now you are changing the role i don't want to be the side character i want to be the main and you're becoming the main character that's the yeah you are the emperor you are the leader and you're becoming that So it's the work that you have been doing with yourself and now you're realizing your own potential here. You are realizing that yes, I can make my dreams come true. I have it in me. I just didn't think that because I was I just I was so conditioned to believe that I was not good enough because people used to compare me and I thought that I'm not good enough, but I am. And as you are understanding more about yourself, there's so much so much to discover. you are going to discover your hidden t- treasures group number 4 in the coming days so much about you you will be discovering and so much potential you have so so much strength how much of a leader you are you're going to discover that how much of a star you are you have that star quality you're going to discover that that's what the late, latest news is for group number 4 hope it made sense hope it resonated if it did give me a thumbs up i'll see you soon bye bye if the last digit of your birth year is number 5 then this is mess- this is the new latest news from the universe for you or if you have also resonated with this image then also it is so let's see what is the latest news for group number 5 from universe there is definitely a surprise element of surprise here 
uh, something that has been hidden from you guys you are going to uh, uh, it is going to be revealed to you guys maybe it's a surprise from your spouse maybe it's a surprise from your parents some sort of surprise or maybe your company will surprise you with a promotion something like that so it's a very good surprise that is coming into light i really feel like that you have always wished for this surprise to come into fruition but finally through someone else this wish of yours is coming true okay so some uh, yeah that's what i'm getting here so something is coming into light a wish if there is a wish regarding travel trip uh you know you want to move somewhere that wish the details of that wish maybe the next steps of for that wish is also coming to for some of you if it's not a gift like if it's not a trip like maybe for some of you it's like a trip you will be gifted like go there and enjoy right maybe it's like a gift that you will get but for other people if that's not the case if you want to relocate somewhere if you want to move abroad maybe the next steps will be shown to you guys those next steps that has been hidden for you you, you didn't know what to do next it's going to be shown to you guys okay and so let's see what else here okay <clears throat> oh we have lot of uh, stars coming up in the coming i you know the groups that i did we had stars and we we have star and then we have this music and this camera as well so something related to your passions that dream of yours is coming true so if you are if you are someone who is really passionate to tra tra to travel to click photos right that wish of yours is coming true maybe for some of you you have a wish um to go somewhere else and learn music or learn something that you really love that wish is also coming true for you guys uh, but you will have to release something that that fear you know maybe when this wish will come true maybe again you want to do this thing as i mentioned you know this is this is a dream of yours it's in it's it's on the back of your mind always and as i mentioned something is coming into light you're getting the next steps but what happens many times when we get to the next steps we kind of get fearful right we kind of fear what if it doesn't work out so those self doubt is what you need to keep yourself away from and trust that this will come true so whenever you're getting that opportunity it's like an opportunity is coming your way to make your dreams come true here if it's learning you are get, getting an opportunity to learn somewhere if it's like working with someone you're getting an opportunity to work with someone but it's like something that you have been wishing for you're getting that information like this is the next step but the fear can stop you the self doubt can stop you and really work on that release that don't self sabotage yourself okay uh yeah uh, so the next steps are definitely given to you guys for some of you there is an element of surprise as i mentioned you will be clicking pictures and that will be a very good memory here for some of you yes clicking pictures music some sort of surprise element is there from your partner from your friends family or maybe for some of you this is like a proposal as well where there will be music and someone is clicking pictures taking videos something like that for some of you you are also getting married that is also there okay so yeah let's see um what else here for group number 5 what is the latest news from the universe uh huh oh we have the main female uh, number 2 like again she is holding the rose she is feeling good i really feel like the number 2 she's feeling confident she is feeling happy i'm getting like she's very uh, like she 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 knows like she can make things happen she can make things work uh, i'm getting here and if you are a male watching this i really feel like uh, that um that your partner will surprise you with something that you never thought of <laughs> and will, but at the same time you wanted it it's like a surprise that you always wanted but you never thought of. thought of it right that you will get it from this person at this time so that is what i'm getting here for some of you you are the one who is uh, uh, who is taking the next steps to your dreams and you might be surprising yourself in that way yeah okay i feel like this is something this surprise is something like for some of you the surprise is something you're expecting at the same time not expecting <laughs> you know sometimes we want it but at the same time we know that it's too much to us for and maybe we, even if we get if we don't get it we are okay but we want it like that is the surprise here yeah okay you're expecting at the same time you're not at that you're not expecting i hope this makes sense okay so let's see 
maybe this is a friend of yours surprising you um yeah but there is definitely an element of surprise and happiness this will bring a lot of happiness wow we have the motivation and again the flower it feels like the sunflower and for me when, whenever i see sunflower it's like such a bright energy so much of positivity optimism is there so yes uh, you will be motivated again it can be like a trip that is coming your way and uh, like you're so motivated to search the places that you have to see and you're packing your bags you're you're uh, you're you're uh, you're preparing your dress list what are dresses you will wear right so yeah it can be like that you will be very motivated for other people it can be with work that you you are being told that you have to move somewhere uh, for work and you will be so motivated because this is something that you want yet you were okay without it as well that's what is coming <laughs> so this is a dream that was there in your mind but at the same time this was not that big of a dream so that's why this surprise element is there and you will be so excited to prepare everything you will be very motivated to wake up early and do all the preparations whatever you need to do before the trip or uh, yeah again it's like a trip for some of you it's like the next steps that are being given for you guys maybe you're collaborating with someone maybe you're getting an opportunity to study somewhere whatever it is you will be very motivated and you will be planning and you will be very positive about this thing okay so let's see what else is it It, it it really feels like you are going to step out of your comfort zone here uh so don't stop yourself don't let the self doubt come in between uh, that is the only uh thing i see here that you need to right uh you need to work on we have delight again she's patiently waiting she's expecting yet she's okay without even if it doesn't happen right and, that, and that's the thing exactly coming your way you have been waiting for this opportunity you have been waiting for this thing you have been waiting to have that trip have that proposal whatever it is right you have you were waiting for that surprise you always wanted it you were delightful you were happy right waiting for it and, and you're receiving it at this time so yes the surprise uh is what is coming your way and it is going to make you so happy um yeah <laughs> uh you will be delighted you will be happy so and again if you look at this word it's like looking forward delightfully it's it's like patiently waiting for something the patience is like it's not at all uh, wanting like it's not controlling it's not forcing anything it's just in the element thinking about it and being happy like if it happens oh i'm so excited if this happens oh if i'm going to go to this trip i'll wear this this like the, you might have thought about it and finally that's happening here yeah okay so let's see Oh, wow again we have a con confirmation here this is a wish of yours that is coming true again this can be like you might have a crush on someone right this can be that as well crush on someone wishing that this person would propose you take you out on date yet, yet it was you were expecting it were you forcing or anything no you, you were you trying to do hard or maybe you were trying to please hard that person no you were in your element you were like oh, if this happens i will just take the next step right if it doesn't happen it's okay like that's the energy that this is what that that is the thing that is coming true for you guys this is not something you are trying really hard no 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 this is not something like that this is something you wished for maybe it's there in your back of your he head but you're so patient with it even if it doesn't happen you're okay with it it's like a big wish yet you're okay without it without it happening yeah so it's just like you're getting it and it's like an icing on the cake that's the feeling i'm getting you're okay with the cake but it's like an icing on the cake <laughs> so yes uh, so you will be feeling very happy yeah okay so let's see what else here group number 5 latest news from the universe <clears throat> oh again we have the three of uh, wands in the reverse it's like a trip that you haven't planned <laughs> that's what you're uh yeah yeah it's really it feels like maybe before when you planned this thing it didn't happen hmm oh, yeah it can be like that before you planned and planned it didn't never happened maybe this is something yeah again then you left it i want it but i'm not forcing it i'm just believing it and now finally as you as you're not focusing too much on it as you're not forcing it it's happening i really feel like before maybe this wish was very important for you guys 
maybe you tried but then it, it failed it gave you a little bit of disappointed disappointment and then you were like i'm not focusing too much on it i'm just taking a break i really feel like that and that's when it's happening <laughs> okay so let's see. um group number 5 latest news from the universe oh for some of you definitely it's love okay again romance here um um yeah so for some of you yes you might be getting a yes from someone this can be a proposal maybe your pa partner is surprising you with some something if you're single uh, someone is definitely in love with you they might be proposing maybe you tried before they didn't yeah, uh, say yes maybe this is the time they are coming towards you uh, so yeah um the disappointment maybe uh, this thing before it might have made you anxious as well that's why you were like i'm not expecting any more even though i'm expect expecting i'm not you know i'm not waiting for it i'm expecting that's it and i'm patient and i i see that now things are opening for you guys in love this can be something that you love doing yeah this is not only romance this is something that you love doing because she has a rose as well right so she maybe she received rose it's like a sign of love again this can be like a sign a sign of like you you wanted something and you're getting the opportunity to go ahead with it this is something that you love and uh, the doors are open now before you try that it didn't happen now it's happening okay so let's see the final messages for group number 5 uh oh, wow disappointments are ending here you have been disappointed before this is that thing you have expected this thing but before you expected it with so much of expectation now you are expecting with a delight right that's the difference here i am getting here it's like even if you didn't get it it's okay now you are in that energy before you were not like it if you didn't get it you were very angry you were very you know frustrated now you are like optimistic oh it didn't happen now okay next time next time and that's why it's such a awesome thing i feel like that <laughs> you will be very you will be feeling that happiness okay so let's see uh the final message here yeah family wish is coming true definitely a wish is coming true family oh not only you will be happy your family will be happy for you yeah <laughs> so that's the thing it's like a wish definitely a wish that you have worked on but at the same time uh when you were trying to force it it didn't happen you try and try too hard you were expecting all the time but it didn't happen then you got a lot of disappointment then you cut that disappointment you get rid of got rid of that anxiety and you were like i'm going to expect it but i'm going to wait patiently and that's when it is happening here so yeah that's what the message is for you guys group number 5 hope it made sense hope it resonated if it did give me a thumbs up i'll see you soon bye bye If the last digit of your birth year is number six, then this is your reading. Or if you have been drawn to this image, then also it is your reading. So let's see what is the message, latest news from the universe for my lovely group number six. Okay, so let's see what is the message here. What is the news for you guys, group number six? Oh, I'm seeing you know under a tree, uh, friends are sitting together and having a very great time. So maybe in the coming days you will go for a picnic, or maybe you will have a, a, a you know outing with your friends or family, enjoying. Right, I'm seeing in a park, people, uh, children are playing, everyone is together eating food. So something like that I'm getting. Okay, so let's see what else here. Hmm. Okay. Um so we have oh wow we have like yeah playfulness. I did mention that right that's what uh there is like uh, energy of playfulness happiness. Uh, your heart is going to be filled with love a uh, lot of lighthearted care free energy. So you're going to spend time with the people who you really really love and adore. I feel like that. So there is this time of uh 
like where you're not stressing about anything you're just in the present moment enjoying having fun with people okay uh, that's something i'm getting here uh, again the cat is out and playing it's not hiding anymore and it's with their people who listens to them yeah you are going to be with your comfort people yeah okay so that's something i'm getting here that's one of the news and wow look again the reason why you will be feeling very comfortable is because your work is expanding you are seeing growth in the areas of your life where you wanted to see growth there is manifestations also coming into fruition so now you can just relax and do nothing because you have been wo really working hard i feel like that now you feel like yes i can take a break because this is thing is safe and protected i can just um, not do this thing um, because now i know that everything is in flow so that's the energy here i'm getting here so yeah a manifestation regarding your uh, something that you'd love doing some sort of creative pursuits or your career or it can be like examinations as well right maybe you have studied everything now you are ready to take a break with people because you know that you have done the work and even if examinations are coming uh, you are okay with that because you have done you know that yes you have done the work everything is good and you know that your manifestation will come Uh, yeah or maybe for some of you have received your manifestation so now you are like i can just take a break and just enjoy and do nothing uh, and you will be feeling so safe and protected with your family also yeah maybe you are going to spend time with your cats or dogs um just being in that energy just enjoying yeah okay so let's see what is the message for group number 6 latest news from universe for some of you this can be a, a a wake up call to take a break as well if you are someone who is too hard on themselves working really really hard keep, you always you're keeping keep going keep going maybe this is the time to take a break as well okay so let's see what is the latest news for group number 6 okay wow we have pathway you know exactly this is the thing i was seeing i was seeing trees and you know again the park where people play with football and all and again pathway here you know where you need to go next actually that's why you are ready to take a break here that's one thing i'm strongly feeling here look again occupation here and we have the swing machine here again right so yes this is something with your work with your craft with your manifestations I really feel like that you were working really really hard and you didn't know where you need to go next what should be your next step and so that's why you were trying really hard now you know where you need to go exactly what you need to do because things are moving forward and you know what next steps you need to take so yes you you sometimes we do a lot of trial right or oh, this is not working i should try this this is not working i should try this now you know what you need to do what is working for you and so you can take a break now so you know where you need to go so like the pathway has been shown before it was not there now you know exactly where you need to go so you are like calm relaxed <laughs> yes that's what i'm getting here so you know your next steps and you're patient now and that's the reason of you taking a break having fun uh, embracing that carefree energy here okay so again this can be a student who is just studying they didn't know what to do right how to uh, grasp all that you know take all that information how what to do next but now they have picked up now they have picked up now they have like uh, this plan they have a plan like i'll do this at this time i'll study this so now they know what they need to do so now they're not worrying rather they are enjoying some free time <laughs> yeah okay so let's see um yeah it feels like you're gaining that confidence um so now you can just have fun and have like the free time not stressing too much not anxious um yeah wow we have to <laughs> we have been look again the manifestation and the conference uh, and if you look at this we have this which as well so this manifestation of yours is in your career in some sort of creative pursuits the next steps you know because something that you did is has worked out as i mentioned you you know your what you need to do next you something that you have been planning preparing 
I, I feel like some sort of trials were there and you didn't know what to do. But now you don't have to do any more trials because you know exactly what you need to do. And as you do it, you're getting what you want here. So again, it feels like the bees building their next nest, call it me, they are working hard. Now they are ready. They know that they're going to get the sweet honey again and again and again. So that's what I'm getting here. So you are, you're very sure of what you need to do next. You're it, Again, it feels like climbing the ladders because first two steps you tried, then you fell down and you understood what mistakes you were made making then you did something else you tried again you tried again now something is there that you know it's going to work so now you can take a break here that's what it feels like for some of you in your career in your studies there is like <clears throat> success i'm seeing here um yeah uh, it can be a business as well now you know what is working what is not working <coughs> it feels like you you're understanding the algorithm of something uh, so yeah and uh, you know when you need to do the work when you need to relax so it's like you don't have to do too much now <clears throat> okay group number six what is the message here oh wow we have fulfillment yes look so again you know this <laughs> You know, uh, what I'm getting is like sometimes people start doing something. For example, in winters, they might not have, uh, uh, you know, stored like frozen food. Maybe some 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 seasons we get some some kind of fruits or vegetables in abundance, right? And and you got that. Like I'm just get, giving you an example. Like you got like a lot of peas one one winter. Uh, yeah, I think it's winter on season only peas comes right i don't know i'm sorry if i'm wrong but anyways one season you got it, it's a seasonal uh, vegetable that you got uh, yeah and it was the harvest was too much so what, what you plan is like to uh, to make it frozen so you can use it again right uh, you can use throughout the year so that's why you did it but you made some mistakes and uh, and you had to throw it again uh, throw all those things but now you have learned from that mistake right and you're not making those mistakes because the trial period is over as i mentioned now you're getting that thing like again you're getting that piece uh, like you're and it's frozen correctly everything has been done correctly because you had gone through that trial period you're not making you didn't make any mistakes and now you will have that piece for the entire year and it is going to fulfill you so this is something with your work as well like work your studies yeah it is going to fulfill you throughout the year here yeah, because it will be there for you because this work that you have done, this trial and tribulations that you have gone, the mistakes that you have uh, made and through the mistakes you have learned. Now, this is going to fulfill you for the entire time. Like again, with this pathway, you know where to go and this is going to fulfill your soul in a way. Yeah. So, yes, that's what the message is. Um, uh, and uh, <laughs> I'm sorry if uh, I don't know, you know, I, I think peace. Do we get it in winter season? I'm, I'm not so sure. <laughs> Anyways. Uh, but I feel like there are a lot of seasonal uh, vegetables and fruits. That's what I was telling. Okay. Why well, don't I don't know why, why I got that piece specifically? Anyways, let's see. Um, what else here? Group number. Wow, high priestess. Yes. Uh, for some of you, look again. Which energy is very strong here? Your powerful manifestors. And again, it really feels like this can be for some of you, you understanding how uh, intuition works as well. That, that That is also something I'm getting here. So you are trusting your intuition. So before you didn't know what is your intuition, what is your logical mind. And sometimes you thought this is your intuition and you took action, Didn't th things didn't work out. Then you kept working on your intuition. You kept building that, right? And now you have studied a lot about yourself, like how your intuition feels. What is really your intuition guiding you? What is your fear? You have a mechanism now to detect that right and now this mechanism is helping you in every area of your life so now you know ah this is not my uh, intuition this is my fear before i got tricked by that i thought that is my intuition but it was not now i know i have this mechanism to know uh, what is my fear when is my fear talking when is my intuition talking and you have nailed it right you have worked really hard on it and that's why as you move forward it is going to fulfill you so you know where you need to go so that's what it does here okay <laughs> this is something like that 
Okay, so let's see. <laughs> yeah, death. Wow. Okay, we have the seven of pentacles as well and we have the death. Yes, again, it feels like the fears that you had before is not there anymore. Um, it's, it's ended, right? Um, yeah, again, it, it feels like now you're so connected to your own heart. You know where you need to go. The witch knows. She has the broom and she knows. She is intuitively guided. She knows where she needs to go. The pathway is there. Uh, they know which pathway is there. So they will get that fulfillment. They're not doing that trial period again and again and again. They have learned from their mistakes. So again, that's what it's ending. The trial, tribulations. Now you know clearly where you need to go, how you need to do things. You're listening to your intuition again it's like the magic path of your intuition so you are listening to that path you're going in that path in that direction uh, listening to your intuition and it's going to fulfill you in every way here yeah so there is this end of uh, that chapter where you were doing that trials and uh, not getting anywhere now that has ended now you're trusting your own intuition you're trusting your own creativity and you're walking that path that really suits you that really feels called to you now because you know how what is your intuition and what is your fear you know the difference now so yeah and that as you walk this path you're going to be so fulfilled yes okay uh, so let's see um what else here for group number six wow look contract here the justice the scales you know the scales are going to be balanced before you didn't know how to balance these things, how to balance your logical and your intuitive side. You didn't know that, right? Now you exactly know. You exactly know how to balance it, how to be practically yet spiritual. You know you have nailed that thing, right? For some of you, this can be a new job as well. As I mentioned, uh, something that you're working on, it's taking off. Maybe you're getting some sort of contract signed and you're, you're, that contract is going to fulfill you, right? So this can be a new job or... Um, new place of studies or yes yeah, again okay, a contract signing a contract but this is something that you know is best for you and you as you keep moving forward you're going to listen to your intuition and have that balance uh, and that as you move forward this is going to fulfill you yeah so again you know we have the crown chakra here seventh chakra archangel Uriel again it talks about our intuition the crown chakra is open we are intuitively guided and we're listening to it so yes so for some of you this can be new job as well a new job in a way that you love, something that you love. Before you tried a lot of things, it didn't work out. Now you know exactly what you want to do, where you want to go, what your heart, where, where your heart is guiding you. And you, as as you're trusting your intuition, you're working really hard, and this will really, really fulfill your soul here. Okay, so let's see. Final message for group number six. Final message. I divine final message. Okay. So we have romance in the air. Oh, you will be loving your uh, dream life. It feels like you're entering this new chapter of your life where you're going to, uh, where you're going to get down and smell the roses, where you will be carefree. Yet you're going to get all the things that you want, right? You, you, you are going to be more present with yourself. You will be feeling more connected with life. Yeah. It feels like you're going to roman romanticize your life in a way. You're going to enjoy your life more. Yeah. Let's see the final message here. Group number six. Reconciliation. Wow. Okay. Maybe for some of you, <laughs> you might be meeting with, uh, with someone who you who you love or <laughs> again this can be a meeting of a soulmate energy as well before you were not sure the, whether it's right for you or not now you're sure and you're doing it and maybe this is signing a contract with this person marriage for other people it can be like you know exactly what you love what you need to do what you want maybe before you didn't uh, move forward with that thing because you felt like it's not for you, but now you're very sure that this thing is for you. So this is something that you desire, uh, a career or a hobby that you want to move forward with and you will be moving forward with that as well. So that's all I have for group number six. Hope it made sense. Hope it resonated. If it did, give me a thumbs up. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. The last digit of your birth year is number seven. Then this is reading is for you. Latest news from universe. 
uh, or if you have drawn to this image then also this reading is for you if you're chosen intuitively so let's see what is the message for you guys maybe you're seeing a lot of signs and synchronicities from universe and universe is telling you to open your eyes because there are small small details that you have to pick up in the coming days because these small small details will help you with your life so uh, also trust your intuition as well so maybe some days you will wake up and you will feel like ah, i need to write this down or maybe i need to look at uh, look uh, in my newspaper today so go and look because maybe there might be some details that will really really help out help you out okay so don't um don't uh, you know sometimes we don't see uh, take them very seriously so you know take your intuition seriously and that small uh, callings that you have like to go out to have a walk to call a friend uh, do that because it will be very very beneficial for you guys that's what the message is so let's see what else i'm just hearing nothing is a coincidence for you guys everything is god incidence so you, you your angels are with you you are not alone oh wow look yes again your intuition is going to guide you it's going to again with this look this whenever i see this charm it's like the caution sign the caution sign don't go there you know we have we have we might have seen those sign boards like where they show uh, they they write like don't go go up uh, from this point because it's dangerous like that your your angels are showing you that because they want to protect you so that's why i was talking about listening to your intu uh, intuition don't uh, yeah maybe don't take everything as like a coincidence because maybe there is a message as well so take that uh, take that uh, seriously listen to it okay maybe birds in the coming day coming days will be very significant significant for you guys um yeah so trust your intuition if your intuition is telling you no trust it trust your intuition more than anything in the coming days so that's something as a message for you guys an idea yeah i don't know florence cavalshin uh, in her book talks about like listening to uh, when yeah it's the magic path of int intuition that book she talks about like when our intuition is telling you to do something tomorrow don't do it do it today do it tomorrow like that only when your intuition is saying something to do today do it today if it's tomorrow do it tomorrow don't change that okay don't get um impatient here okay so let's see um maybe you should read the book magic path of your intuition it will really help you at this time if you have already read it it's okay read it again because maybe you will be getting something in from something different from that book you know i have noticed like um as we shift as our uh, frequency gets heightened the same book will give us more <laughs> more depth that it didn't give us before so i will recommend that uh, to read so let's see what else is the latest news from the universe for group number 7 okay so we have uh ah uh, yeah you are your own judge here that's what it is um judication that's what i'm getting here you are your own judge trusting your own instincts trusting your intuition is very important at this time using discernment discernment is the key so even if you are uh, talking to new people yes use your discernment to your advantage your intuition is guiding you at this time so be your own judge here yes okay so when you feel like you need to protect yourself protect yourself when you feel like yeah i shouldn't do this don't do it so be your be your own judge practice discernment guys that's what i feel like don't trust anyone and everything trust your instincts trust your gut here in the coming days that's um the message here for you guys group number 7 pick up on the small small details because your universe angels is sending you a lot of signs and messages maybe you're someone who have seen a feather flying from above you know sometimes we see the feather uh, like it's it's i have seen that you know from the sky it falls low down like that so beautiful to see maybe you have seen that maybe you have seen 11 11 maybe you have uh, seen 111 1. maybe you're wearing a color pink right now or black and blue maybe for some of you have jeans on blue jeans um yeah uh, maybe some of your hairs are in a ponytail uh, okay so i just said uh, saw that uh, yeah so let's see what else here what is the message for group number yeah look wow we have solitude and we have the compass you are your own guide at this time because when you're alone when you're spending time with yourself you know what's best for you so if there is something 
a decision that you need to make don't rush that decision in the coming days take your time and then only then only make that decision so maybe in the coming days someone will force you to make a decision don't get forced to make the decision fast just take your time think about it and then only move forward do the research that you want to first connect with your heart then do the research use your discernment to your advantage so if someone is trying to force you to do something please take your time take a step back from that person you know many times that happened maybe someone is like invest in this thing it is going to give you so much returns don't be for, for, don't feel that pressure to sign that paper very fast have that patience take your time use your discernment you know call upon people who knows about it take that time and then only make a decision okay so that's what universe is telling you take your time to make a decision don't make a decision in a rush be cautious about it and don't you know maybe there is someone who talks talk 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 have you seen the people who wants to sell something they will talk 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 and say some so many things um and they make us feel like that it's such a good thing to have but maybe maybe they might scam us right so don't get into that sweet talking use your discernment here hmm that's very important uh because when you are in the solitude energy and you're connecting with your own compass you will know that that what that person said was all bs but at that time you know when they force us to make a decision many times that happens they force some you know have you seen sales person they talk so sweetly sometimes they you know the, the <coughs> sometimes even though we don't want any object or something like that thing to buy they will force us uh, sorry um they will force us to buy and then later we will go at go to back to our home and then we'll be looking at the objects that we bought and we like why did i bought this and there are many times uh, things might have happened like that uh, so that but this is a big thing this is a big decision to be made so don't don't take this decision very very quickly use your discernment to your advantage that, uh, be very cautious uh, yeah don't believe anyone at this time take your time it's very important for you guys to take your time before making a uh, important decision okay um yeah if someone is pressuring you don't feel that pressure take your time maybe it's because they want something from you that's why they're pressuring you okay it's very important yeah look it's very important to focus on your security at this time so maybe there is someone some sort of financial investment this you will be meeting someone and this person might force you to invest in something maybe they're telling like do it fast do it fast otherwise this offer will go no don't get into it don't get into it okay take your time take your time you know take your security seriously if you if you are giving your money or if you are investing something please 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 take your time use your discernment protect yourself so redo the research spend time with yourself do the research and then only make a decision here so yeah in a piece wow we yeah. are and again whenever you're making that decision you know if does it doesn't feel peaceful if this person is continuously telling you calling you and asking you uh, for the next step next step next step don't do it in a very fast way because it, because when you're doing it in the fast way you will not feel peaceful so whenever you're signing anything it should feel that peace you should feel that happiness it shouldn't feel rushed it shouldn't feel like oh am, am i doing it very quickly or fast no 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 it should feel peaceful it sh you should be ready for it you 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 have to feel that peace because once you feel that peace then it's the correct decision if you're not feeling it the peace it's not so always trust that okay trust your intuition here yeah if even if it's like buying a home buying anything or signing papers or signing something some sort of policies investment uh yeah be very cautious about it or uh, contracts anything because when you sign it it should give you that satisfaction that fulfillment like yeah i am doing the correct job it shouldn't be rushed you shouldn't feel like oh i should do it i should do it either way uh, time is running out you shouldn't feel like that you should feel that calmness peacefulness and you should feel like i'm making the correct decision for me not only you have to um, get you know, yeah uh, make that decision here this can be you signing contract something like that take your time there is nothing wrong with taking time here that's what universe is telling you so let's see uh, 
it's it's about you isn't it don't let anyone force you to do something yeah sometimes you know people kind of <clears throat> force us i am i'm reminded of a scenario like that you know we went to a travel yeah some some sort of travel um things they told us like this much they will offer that much they will offer and all and we had this for 2 hours they were like just talking talking and my husband kind of <laughs> fall into that but uh, you know at the end of the day that they, that was not good place right they were scamming people so yeah so always listen to your instincts okay so but it's very easy because i saw my husband uh, um like trusting them <laughs> at that time yeah okay so let's see what else sometimes you know people have a way with words and sometimes the pressure and they tell us like oh this offer will finish at this time you should make this decision fast if someone says you like that to make a decision very fast <sighs> take a breather take a step back you need your time to make a decision always remember that you have that right to make a decision and saying no is okay also okay sometimes we are we might feel like how oh, i can say no even though you are feeling it like no 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 you are like oh my god this is good one but how how can i say no because this person has been spending so much time talking to me how can i say no you have every right to say no never think that okay <laughs> okay because i know certain people i'm also like that but i'm changing you know sometimes when we are not being thought to set boundaries and when we are not thought to say no we kind of please people and and it can be a very big disadvantage to us so please okay so make decision um after think you know you are spending time researching then only make that decision um yeah do, wow we again it feels like eight of wands and two two don't make a fast decision guys don't make a fast decision because again when you will make that uh, yeah when you whenever you're making that decision if your heart and mind is not in alignment don't make it don't make it if we, if logically everything is go, feeling good but your heart is not saying yes please at that time don't make a fast decision guys take your time when you feel that peace when you feel that balance like ah my heart and mind is saying the same thing yes i can go for it right logically also this looks good heart wise also i'm feeling good so i'm going to go so don't make a fast decision use your discernment be cautious that's what the message is for you guys uh, group number 7 here so yeah wow look again sometimes so saying no is um is an act of courage right <laughs> setting your boundaries is an act of courage Tr not trusting everyone and not pleasing everyone is an act of courage and you have that so be confident in your own decisions take your time you have you have every right to make your decision at your own speed right remember that here <laughs> that's what universe is telling you group number 7 let's see the final messages love oh even if it's about love oh my god love and reconciliation so maybe this is about a person returning returning back and telling you that they will offer you this time that 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 or maybe this is something that you love is returning back and you're a little bit hesitant because in the past things didn't work out if you're hesitant if it doesn't feel peaceful take your time and align with your heart logically you might feel like it's good but maybe your heart is like telling you no 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 say no if you feel like saying no say no if you feel like saying yes for that you have to take some time off don't make a rushed decision that's what universe is telling you because when you when you take a step back when you're not influenced by other people you're just connected to your own intuition at that time you will know what's best for you so that's what the message is okay so let's see the final cards uh time to act oh wow again the lion energy is there right you are a courageous person you can do anything and make anything happen you have every right to say no if you don't want to say yes you can say no so don't like lion doesn't please anyone does he no he is the king of the jungle he is his own boss so be your own boss be your own like take your own judgment seriously be your own judge here group number 7 and do what feels right what feels best to you do that maybe it will not feel best to other people 
but what feels best to you what's what, what will make you happy it's time to act on that that means if saying no say no <laughs> right if you feel like saying yes say yes so it's up to you at the same at the end of the day but you have to take your security seriously how you feel seriously if it's going to give you inner peace all those things right and then only say yes so that's all i have for group number 7 hope it made sense hope it resonated if it did give me a thumbs up i'll see you soon bye bye if the last digit of your birth year is number 8 or if you have chosen this image then this is your message latest news from the universe for you guys group number 8 so let's see what is the latest news for you guys group number 8 okay i'm hearing the word illumination here something will be illuminated some sort of information that you didn't have before you're going to have it okay so let's see what is the message here the latest news i'm seeing a uh, you know pyramids here something with pyramids okay so let's see oh, again pyramid is in the shape of triangle the you know the alignment of body mind and soul yeah maybe something will be illuminated that will give you a lot of peace hmm you're getting out of a trickster trickster energy no one can trick you anymore group number 8 you're getting out of that trickster someone was tricking you before it can be our own self right sometimes it tricks us not anymore you're getting rid of that trickster energy okay let's see no one can trick you anymore okay oh wow okay wow look there is a new beginning uh, with love something is ending uh, yeah again there is a new beginning in terms of love this can be you loving life again you're starting to love life again because there is no tr trickster energy you're very sure of yourself so you have started to enjoy life and you have embracing that self love energy there is a little bit of happiness that you feel within yourself you know before you were not able to feel now you're able to feel so your mental health is going to be very good i feel like that so if you have dealt with a lot of issues you know i even feel like for some of you if you are feeling sad if you're feeling depressed you're coming out of that now you are getting into a phase of your life where there is happiness where you feel happy from within because you are becoming uh, your own source of happiness you are not you know sometimes what happens uh, we we depend on other people for our own happiness isn't it i see that that chapter of your life has ended and now you are entering a new chapter of your life where you are finding your own source of happiness that is coming from you not from other people so so again when once the source of happiness starts coming from within us we are going to be happy because we are not dependent we are not attached because it's coming from within right so yeah that is the journey you are moving towards here that's what i'm getting from the charm and yeah for some of you there is this new relationship also and in this new relationship yes relationships give us lot of happiness right but even though you're going into this new relationship the way you used to approach relationship before it is not going to be the same now because now you are going to find that happiness from within yourself not attaching too much yet you are attached right again it's it feels like when we are in a relationship we need to have that love and all right but at the same time when we become too attached to it to that that's when we feel that pain and and suffering and all i feel like here uh, even if you're getting into a new relationship you will be focusing on your growth your expansion you will be setting boundaries you know that that's very important and you will be your own source of happiness yes if someone is making you happy you're going to be happy that's not what i'm saying but you're not relied on that yeah you're not relied on other person to make you happy because you are becoming your own source of happiness yeah okay that's what this new journey is about here for group number 8 your mental health is going to be very good you will be feeling very optimistic you will be feeling like yes i i am ready to wake up and take on my day that kind of vibe i'm seeing here uh so let's see what is for group number 8 <clears throat> latest news oh wow <laughs> great fortune look and this great fortune you know 
it is not always about money it's about our health it's about who we are sharing our home or space or friendships right it's all it's all great for, fortune if you have amazing friends it's it's a very good fortune to have if we have uh, uh, amazing supportive people around us wow right amazing relationships yes so you are getting that kind of good great fortune again this can be money as well you are having that enough money to spend on yourself to have a comfortable life you know uh, yes so that's something is something i'm getting here so there is happiness optimism great fortune um in terms of people relationship work yes so a happy beginning is happening here okay uh so let's see what else group number 8 latest news from the universe for group number 8 good health yeah oh wow we have news here <laughs> we are talking about the latest news look spiritual as in the back of the deck you're connected to your own inner happiness you're connected to that small voice in a voice and you're listening to it so once we are connected to that intuitive voice we come out of our comfort zone do something that is challenging and face our own fears we don't run away from problems rather we run towards the problems because we know that when we run towards the problems that's when the solution arises if you're running away then more problems will be there to tackle so i'm i'm seeing that shift in you there is this shift as i mentioned there is this illumination that happened that shifted you uh shifted you so much uh, that made you a different person so this is like new you are not you're not listening to that tricky voice inside of you anymore you're listening to your intuitive voice that voice from uh within that makes that is best for us it does what is best for us right it challenges us as it takes us our comfort zone but it's best for us it it helps us to face our fear right so i feel like you're going to be connecting to that in a voice that really really help you to become a better person become a better version of you and that will help you to find that source of happiness that has always within you, within you you were trying to uh, get it from some somewhere but you are finding that it, you can you can um become the source of your own happiness you can be the reason of your own happiness you don't need any other reason right you being you can become like yeah you been you that happiness can from come can come from within you like that's the energy i'm getting here yeah wow okay so there is spiritual growth definitely uh and maybe there are certain rituals that uh, that you will be doing it will give you a lot of happiness so let's see again there might be a news in terms of love in terms of love there is a new beginning here for some of you that is also latest news here and yeah if you are single you are entering in a new relationship and that new relationship is going to give you a lot of happiness it is of great fortune okay <laughs> and if you are already married maybe certain things have changed because you have been il illuminating you have you have been changing your habits and that's that's resulting in your relationships to become stronger to become happy yeah your relationships are becoming better and better yeah okay so let's see group number 8 group number 8 latest news from the universe for group number 8 uh blue might be a color of importance i feel like your throat chakra is also healing because we have this blue feather and look at the uh, letters both are blue color right and um then look we have this blue over here as well and then we have the blue as well <laughs> so happiness yeah again you are becoming the joy of your own life you're not attaching uh, every you're not feeling like someone else should make you happy you're over that thing so even if you're getting into a new relationship you are becoming that joy of happiness so as you become that joy as you are becoming that happy person you're radiating it and your relationships are improving here so that's something i'm seeing very strongly violet color is also something i'm seeing very very strongly so your crown chakra is opening you're connected to the higher realms and that's the reason of you uh, finding the joy from within you're finding that happiness from within you're becoming your own a uh, source of happiness here you're not relying on anyone something external is not yeah it, it feels like sometimes we are so much focused on the external to make us happy but here you are not focusing on that yeah you're focusing on yourself 
finding ways to be happy or becoming that source of happiness yeah i really feel like that and that's improving not only your life but the relationships your finances every area of your life as you're finding that inspiration joy from within it's it's helping you to improve every other area of your life that's where you're getting that good fortune here so happy times <laughs> yeah okay so let's see yes and in order to reach there it's difficult i know that but finally you are here and that's beautiful so so maybe for some of you this great fortune can be a news uh, of love it can be low news of uh, money as well okay for some of you a good job raise promotion that is also there okay that will make you happy yes as i mentioned you're finding that source of happiness from within you so so as we find that so uh, happiness from within ourselves the outside also shows up right so within so without something like that that's what i'm getting okay <clears throat> so there is a lot of joy happiness i see here if you are someone who is a um, single you will be mingling with people you will have someone to share a lot of things with and you will be vibing with them if you are already in a partnership there is great news maybe your partner is also uh, getting a raise so you are all happy that is also the energy there a lot of happiness is there okay so news of happiness news of good fortune and that will lead to a lot of love uh Three of Wands. So there is a, a, a travel thing. Also, I'm getting maybe news of travel. You will be traveling with your partner, or maybe you are getting into a relationship, and this relationship is blossoming. You're traveling. Maybe both of you love traveling, so you will be traveling a lot. Um, again, you have been working on yourself in order to reach to this place in your life. You have worked really, really hard to find the source of happiness from within ourselves. It's a work that we have to do and find you are here and i see that you will be so proud of yourself so things are working out in your favor whatever your plans are keep on planning keep on working because it is all going to come into fruition <clears throat> okay so wow we have the empress on the floor wow look at the number 333 hmm so yeah <clears throat> you're creating that happiness you're creating that happiness within yourself you're not relying if you look at the empress she is abundant she is abundant in herself right and that's why she is mother earth in her way right she can create anything and uh, she gives without any fear because she can create anything she is the creator and like that only you are becoming the creator of your own life you're creating something that makes you happy you're finding the joy within yourself you're finding that peace within yourself and again there might be a lot of uh, creative things that you will be doing and you will be finding satisfaction and fulfillment maybe your creative works are giving you a lot of great fortune for some of you this can be pregnancy as well <laughs> okay so maybe a new beginning with a new child that is going to bring you a lot of love and happiness yeah okay so let's see you are very fertile at this time and you're going to grow so much fortune <laughs> yes so let's see your ideas are going to work out so the storm clouds are gone because the reason why it's gone is because you chose to run towards the storm clouds you didn't run away from your problems you chose to face your problems and you did that and that's why you're getting this you chose to understand ah this habit of mine is not working i got to work on it i got to work on myself you ah uh, yeah sometimes we run our if we we run from ourselves isn't it but you didn't you didn't run for your from yourself you understood yeah this this is something i need to work on and i have to make the change i know it's it's something it's tiring it's it's going to take all my energy but i'm going to do it and you did it that's what it is the work that you have done now you can read the rewards <clears throat> oh, wow money is coming for sure there is no doubt so if you if there were uh, problems with money the good fortune is in the money area more money so now uh, again with this empress abundance your hard work is paying off so maybe you have understood that mindset is not good so you worked on your mindset for some of you it can be the the you know the work that we have to do 
and you did the work maybe this can be you working on a skill improving your skill and now it's going to give you that money yeah so there is financially it's a good news good fortune a <laughs> great fortune I, not only financially it can be in relationship as well look with the red color this is a passion that you have finally it's taking off and it's giving you so much of abundance yeah that you always wanted but even though you're getting this like externally you're not attaching yourself to this gain you're happy that it's happening but you're not attaching yourself to it and that's so amazing so you're coming out of if financially things were tough on you that's going to change <clears throat> uh, so let's see the final message your final message from my lovely group number eight oh we have club someone will try to make you or do something against you well that stopped you i feel like that's where you worked really really hard you didn't give your power away yeah sometimes you know people do that to and sometimes when we are attached to people we do that for them as well even if it's bad for us many times i feel like you have worked on that and you have you have worked on that habit of yours and now when you need to say no you're going to say no no one can make you do anything against your will yes so let's see the final well, that's a lot <laughs> so let's see the final message for group number eight okay wow grasshopper oh look we have the happiness car happiness happiness so yes you're, you're freeing yourself from those kinds of attachment that made you feel like you have to do certain things to be happy but now as you are becoming the source of your own happiness you don't have to do that isn't it <laughs> yes again yeah maybe this person try to make you feel like if you will not do it you are not going to be balanced you will not have this you will not have that because once we are attached to someone we will feel like that right that we have to do it otherwise we will lack this we will lack that but once it start coming from our, ourselves we don't feel that and i see that you are at the stage where you don't feel like and you you are not going to do something for someone if you don't want to do it you're only going to do it if you want it right yeah oh look pay attention again it feels like your mental health physical health is all improving that's what it is as your your life is getting balanced your finances are getting balanced uh, your health wealth yep it's coming it's it's balancing at this time that's what the news is as i mentioned for some of you you might have uh, um mental health mental health you know problems maybe you you, you were not feeling that happiness when our mental health is not good yeah life is going to be dry right we will not feel that kind of uh, fertility right we will not feel that joy it's balancing here so that's all i have for group number 8 hope it made sense hope it resonated if it did give me a thumbs up i'll see you soon bye bye if the last digit of your birth year is number 9 then this reading is for you latest news from the universe or if you have chosen this image intuitively then also this message is for you so let's see group number 9 what is the latest news for you from universe i'm seeing a lot of birds blue bird a blue bird maybe there is a meaning please check the spiritual meaning of blue bird so maybe that that is a specific message for some of you a very beautiful home uh, a villa kind of a home near a beach and that's what i'm been shown maybe that is also a clue for some of you or a news regarding some sort of house home uh, your security is on on the way for you okay so let's see group number 9 what is the message here oh i'm seeing a bird flying high yeah again it it feels like what i got look that bird yeah what i felt you know the bird is flying high free from all the obstacles fears anxiety and it's just peaceful and it's free it has that freedom to fly anywhere yeah that's the energy okay so let's see group number 9 you are you are getting away from all those illusions and you're seeing the truth very very clearly and the truth is setting you free hmm. the oh wow i was seeing a bird flying we have the plane and we have the butterfly as well yeah there is some sort of changes coming your way yeah look again it feels like 
the this can be this knife can be you cutting yourself from that anxiety that fear and you're flying high you're going towards your goals you're making the necessary changes for some of you this can be relocation because i saw a home yeah a relocation changing homes a home that you wanted for yourself you are going to stay there maybe you are going to change places relocation is there for you guys yeah some some sort of places change for other people this is again you getting out of your fear anxiety and you're flying high flying high again you know it feels like some of you were climbing the stairs and climbing stairs take time now you are in this lift so you're much faster than the stairs here that's the energy that's the change happening here you now you are in the lift not in the stairs anymore now you are going to be lifted very fast so it feels like an ascension is happening and as you are ascending you are finding lot of key messages like key things that will help you yeah you are understanding like this this thing this thing is important and this is not important so let me let go of that and focus on what is important you are understanding so much more about yourself you have already understood so much but more is coming maybe for some of you are unlocking certain gifts of yours as well as you are ascending more 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 is coming here and as you unlock those gifts you are going to change lot of things yeah a lot of things you will change you will change how you used to see yourself it's changing the way you used to do things is changing the way you talk everything is changing here you're becoming more confident i see and as you're making those change everything is safe everything is protected <laughs> okay uh yeah for some of you this key can be indicate uh, it's indicating like new home i did mention a new home a new home that it's kind of a home that you always wanted to live it's kind of a place that you always wanted to live yeah so let's see um but it's more about you know this aeroplane is like you flying high you you letting go of that fears you making the necessary changes you understanding yeah this is the key thing that i need to change and i'm changing and i'm cutting it off and now i'm free from those that anxiety that repeated patterns that repeated uh, you know sometimes we have that repeated behaviors that is not good for us you're cutting all those things yes yeah this is your time of ascension uh, yeah this is your time of ascend you're ascending guys group number 9 uh, that's what i'm getting spiritually you're moving forward there is it feels like you you will you will have that power that you will feel like it feels like you're stepping in your power and you will feel that power that yes if i want something i can make it happen with the help of divine i can co create anything with the divine that's the feeling yes you are in the co creating energy where you can create anything with you, with the help of universe yes okay so let's see group number 9 we have marriage oh again this marriage you know first of all marriage maybe for some of you that's the thing that that's the change you're getting married moving to a new place wherever you wanted to stay you're staying maybe this is honeymoon also where you're traveling that is also there but more it feels like the contract that you have with divine right you're fulfilling your divine contract i feel like that and that's why you're going to feel that satisfaction here um you know it feels like your soul is remembering why you are here because that's the reason you are understanding oh this is the this is like the behavior i got it from other people this is not me this is not my authentic self so i'm just getting rid of it and i am fulfilling yeah fulfilling my contract like who i am why i am here i'm doing it so i i see you connected with your life purpose i see you connected with your heart more and more and more i see you fulfilling your contract i feel i i see you connected to your soul remembering your soul gifts accessing your soul gifts and using that using that to your advantage and doing something that you came here to do yeah yeah uh for some of you this can be marriage as well as simple as it signing contracts you know uh, getting married celebrating anniversaries uh going out on a trip enjoying your time with your partner but other otherwise it's like the contract that you have with divine you're connected to it you're working towards it you're giving that commitment to it 
and you're moving forward and as you're moving forward it, with it as i mentioned you're co-creating with universe like again you're co-creating with universe uh, so you're becoming in this you're you're coming in this energy of this co-create co-creator like you create yeah in this energy of creator you're stepping into this creator energy where you can create anything that you want with the help of divine and that's what your purpose is like and i feel like the reason why this uh, creations will come the reason why these resources will come because you are right on track and you're doing something that you're meant to do so yeah <clears throat> so let's see and for other people your marriage is also going to improve here there because of the necessary changes you have made in your life so maybe i see that uh, your marriage is also going to improve your spouse will be more understanding Uh, because now you are connected to your uh, to yourself now you're connected to your life purpose so it's making you happy and once we become happy once we are in in alignment yeah our life becomes better and better and that's what i'm getting so let's see um group number 9 oh wow look luck Oh look 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 yes it feels like you will feel lucky the reason is you connected to again it feels like you connected to your life purpose you're doing something your soul agreed to do you're doing something that makes you happy so you're ha so so you are in this optimistic um energy right you are you are you are you're feeling good even if things doesn't work out in your favor you're okay because you know that if it is if it didn't work out maybe it's not for me i'll try some other method you're in that energy so you are in the reason why you're going to feel so lucky is because you are in that energy you are in that kind of positive energy you are the reason of your own luck so luck is on your side we have dragonfly as well butterfly as well so the changes that you are making in your mindset the changes that you are making in your behavior is the cause of this luck it's not just dropping down from somewhere it's because you worked hard you started thinking like that that's the reason of this luck here and that's why i was mentioning like you were climbing the stairs for so long not understanding why you have to go two steps back then climb three steps again two steps back three steps forward not any more now you're in the lift shum you're just going up <laughs> yes so the so in the areas where you have felt drained where you felt unlucky that is the areas you're getting luck the reason it's you because the work you have done because the trust you have shown because the faith you have shown because of the negativity you have cut from your life right you have cut so much you have cut so much of toxic habits of yours you have worked on your thoughts patterns everything i see that the commitment that you have shown to yourself is what is giving you this luck it's not falling from above you did the work that's why so as you move forward in this journey people will say that you're lucky and you take it but you know <laughs> where you got that luck luck it's your mindset it's the way you are you are the reason for your luck and that's what universe wants to tell you today <laughs> yeah okay so let's see okay so we have diligence look diligence here look at the word looking at the bigger picture knowing where where it needs to land where is the best place you have been in this energy and i sh i i saw a bird flying high right and that's exactly this image is showing yes you had you have you are you, you are the people who have cultivated the patience the faith the trust you have done so much work because of the work now you're seeing the results that's what it is because now you know what's best for you what's not best for you what are your patterns what are your toxic habits that you need to get rid of you understand it you work on it you eliminate it you're so consistent with yourself oh my god so many people are not consistent and that's that's the result they don't get many results right you you are consistent even when you don't see that much of results you're consistent you're dedicated you devote yourself to certain task like yes i want to learn this i'm devoting maybe i'm not that great at it but i know if i devote 
every five minutes, like a uh, five minutes daily or ten minutes daily, I will get better at it. And you do that. Not everyone does that, right? You make time for that, those things, and that's the reason of this. So you made time for this thing. You you improved on your thoughts. You worked on your thoughts. Again, working on your thoughts is not an easy thing. Every day we have to discipline. Every day, even when chaos happens, we have to get back to that optimism. It's not it's not easy, but you are, you have already done it. Now see the results. That's what universe is telling you. Your diligence, the way you showed that trust, faith when nothing was working, the way you were disciplined when nothing was working, the way you came again and again and again, even when things were not working. You have shown your dedication. Now prepare yourself for the results. <laughs> I really feel like that's what the message. Now prepare yourself for the miracles. Yeah. Okay, so I feel like you're going to live a life of luxury, group number nine. And that's why I saw a person in a villa near a beach and they're very, they're in this, they're in their own skin, very comfortable, feeling happy. Yeah, you know, you imagine you have a dream home, right? Yeah. <laughs> and you want it in a particular place and you're getting it, how you will feel. That's the energy I'm picking up here. That's what you're going to get. That's how you're going to live your life. Yes. So that's what the message is from universe. Six. Okay. We have the law, rest and the loss. So look again. You're healing all those losses. Because we. Have, this is the healing card. Four of swords is my healing card and rest. And loss. Yes. All the losses that... You had gone through, you're healing it. Again, you're, the change here, you're moving forward. Oh my God, look at the number here. I did mention leveling up, you get going to the lift, right? From four to five, five to six, like that, right? Four, five, six might be a number you're seeing as well. So things are changing for you guys. You are not going to be hurt anymore. You have healed that hurt. Now things are moving forward for you guys. You're going to see the changes, amazing changes. The Again, with this loss, I can see why you felt that hurt. No matter how hard you try, you might have got, gotten hurt again and again and again. So many times, isn't it? So many disappointments, so many hurt. Yeah, again, sometimes we do certain things and it doesn't work out. It hurt us. Maybe there might be people who hurt us again and again and again. You're healing all those things. You're coming out of it. You are coming out of it. You're leveling up, right? You're ascending. That's what it is. You're not in that past life of yours. The past is over and done. You're now going into this new reality where... Where all that diligence, all that hard work, all that consistency is showing results. Yes. So let's see what else here for group number nine. <laughs> Magician and the mirror. Yeah, you made it, guys. Yes, you practice mirror principle. I, I don't know, knowingly or unknowingly. You know, again, what is mirror principle? It's like something that we are thinking is going to be brought to us by the universe. And that's why I was talking about you are the co-creator of your life. You're co-creating with the universe all the time. So sometimes we do it intentionally. Sometimes we do it unintentionally. I really feel like you have been in intentionally working on your thoughts. You have been doing this mirror principle. So what is mirror principle? So if, if we are someone who are going through negative situation, but we are thinking positively, we are always focusing on this positive thoughts, even if our surroundings is not that great. So what happens is universe has to bring that positivity into our life. The same happens for the negative thinking as well. If you we are having positive things outside, but we are negatively thinking, universe will bring that negative scenarios. So like that only, you, even if things were not working out in your favor, you were always focusing that this is going to work out for me. It is done. It is done. You just kept focusing. And I know that it's so hard, right? But you were doing it. You were just focusing on that positivity. You were focusing on the luck, when, even when you didn't have that luck. And now universe is bringing that. Yeah, things are going to look so balanced, so beautiful. Yeah. So let's see <coughs> what else for you guys. Group number nine. You are the magicians of your own life. This is the life you're creating. And the reason why you're, I feel like you're right on track with your destiny, right? And you're meant to have all those good, good things. Um, yeah, I really feel like all the resources that you want is going to come. If you want a home, you will be able to have that. So for some of you, if you want to relocate and have a home, that's definitely happening. If you want to change places, that's definitely happening here. If you want to travel, 
that is also happening okay so we have uh, advice from a friend dog barking ladder oh wow oh, i didn't mention you know the ladder and the stairs uh, you are getting into the lift like again climbing towards success here um so advice from friend a dog barking so maybe for some of you um i'm not getting anything from this dog wait wait a second let's see more what else it is um okay final messages um uh, we have dolphin wow and we have caterpillar so a change will uh, things will not be always the, sorry things will not always be this way a change is coming a financial gain is usually coming from something you did in the past again the work that you did in the past now it's what you're going to see the change again that's what it is they like the caterpillar the caterpillar if they are going to stay in their comfort zone they will stay but if the caterpillar is like i want to become the butterfly i'm going to do anything to become the butterfly because i know the change will happen and it keeps working then it will become the butterfly right like that only you did it the these past efforts of yours are showing up now that's the change and i feel like this dog a uh, dog barking i need more information for that so we'll just clarify this dog barking for you guys and then we will end the reading so final message here please clarify the dog barking why this dog barking is here thank you divine dog barking okay we have uh, yeah people so we have like oh we have this uh, pentacles like princes of pentacles and prince of pentacles and if you look at these two people <laughs> like again the cycle right again it, uh, this is like these two people are very grounded right um and uh, they focus they they don't focus on fast things right they are someone who is diligent and they are like focusing yeah if i do the work at this time maybe intent yeah instantly i'm not going to get the results right like again you know the instant drama and you're not someone who is going to ha- focus on the instant drama you're the one who will make your own noodles even though if it if it takes time it's okay because you know that is what is healthy for you guys isn't it that's the energy here again so that's what it is this is about you that's why i felt like i need to pick a clarification because i was not getting any friend energy so you co created with the universe you took your time it was not an easy thing right again this is a thing that is slow yet stable it, it was not easy to have that connection with the universe it's not easy right you have to work on yourself you have you have to be strong right you have to keep you even if things are not working out you have to show up again and again and again and you do it you did it and that's the reason of this growth and construction you made your own construction in a way like the building of a home we have to have that foundation very strong then only brick by brick we do we cannot um, yeah if if you are not taking that enough time uh, for the foundation to set in the home might not be strong enough right and you did it your foundation is strong you showed up for yourself and finally now you be ready to see the results that's it so that's all i have for group number 9 uh, hope it made sense hope it resonated if it did give me a thumbs up i'll see you soon bye bye